happened to me. You're the love of my life. Knowing you has been a blessing. I cannot love you less. Today, I want to go on this journey with you. The journey of a lifetime. I think she's here. so perfect baby thank you so much sugar damn <laughs> have you been good you look so beautiful when will you ever stop flattering me maybe when i stop breathing oh gosh baby you're funny you can say that again <laughs> i'm not so sorry i kept you waiting i was struggling with my makeup well i've told you with or without makeup you still look beautiful all right yeah Right. Okay, come right here. We've been waiting for you. Yeah, really. Mm-hmm. Watch it, baby. Look yeah. at that. Look at that. <laughs> I can't. I can't. I can't. Oh, thanks, babe. Mom. Mom. Oh. Mom, she's here. Hello. Good day, Mom. Have we met before? It might be possible, ma'am, because um, I see a lot of people every day. I work in the bank, actually. Oh. Mom, come on, I told you, have you forgotten? You work in the bank? Yes, ma'am. You're welcome to my house. Thank you so much. Please sit down. All right. <laughs> your mom is beautiful. And you're more beautiful. And all the cops here and there. Oh, thank you, ma'am. <laughs> Thanks for sit the compliment. Down. You're welcome. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> Dad. What's that? He's coming, he's upstairs, he's coming. She's beautiful. <laughs> you said that again. Uh -huh. You know, I'm so nice. She's here. <laughs> Dad. Good afternoon, <laughs> sir. She's so beautiful. <laughs> Our son has eyes for beautiful things. <laughs> Jay. Dad, is this the girl we've been waiting for? Yes, mm -hmm. she's the one. Isn't she beautiful? Extremely beautiful. You, you already know I have good eyes for good things, just like my father. Don't go there. Of course. Young lady. <laughs> Sir? If you know what is good for you, you will not come to this house again. Now get out. What? Uh, How? Come back, come back, come back. Let me warn you. Don't ever in your life get anywhere close to my son again. Okay? Now get out. <laughs> are, 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 are you serious right now? What happened? Talk to me. Sit up. Six. What is the problem? Just let me go. Let no, me I go. cannot let you go. Talk to me. Have you met my father before? What is happening? I want to go. Hey, you're getting me nervous and scared. Can you talk to me? Do you know my father? You're hurting me. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go, please. I don't want to hurt you. Just go away. They don't call it customer service for nothing. Because you must service the customer. If you want the big deposit, deposit, yeah. you have to bring a sweet benefit. Sweet benefit in business. You need customer service. Breast is for interest. I mean, can you tell me what the problem is? Ah, what was the meaning of that? No, no, no! Don't tell me to calm down, mom. What was that? Jim, 
Don't ever talk to me like that. Are you out of your senses? Honey. Now, let me warn you. I don't want to ever see that kid here again. But you can at least tell us. You have always wanted our son to marry a working man. What is man really going girl. on? And Perida just left works in the bank. And that's a high profile job. What is going on? Can you tell us why you don't want her for our son? Jim, that kind of girl is not good for you. And I don't want to see her with you headfoot. Is that understood? No. no. Don't discuss it. No, you have to tell me the reason. Don't discuss it. You have to tell me the reason, Father. Nah. Okay, let me take it off. Come, come, let me take it off. Yeah. Okay. You might spoil things. No, no, I don't want you to have issues with your father. I'll, I'll take care of it, okay? Just calm down. No, Everything no. will be fine. No, yeah. no, no, calm down. Everything will be fine. Just one minute, okay? Excuse me. Have you met that girl before? I don't want to talk about that girl anymore. I have made my position clear and nothing will change it. Don't you think we deserve an explanation to what just happened downstairs? Tell me, what is going on? I don't want to hear the knock from yesterday. A knock from yesterday. What does that mean? Have I not made myself clear enough that I don't want to talk about this girl anymore? Have I not? I should be heading out. Excuse me. Just calm down. I don't know. I just don't know what's going on. I, I, I can't just understand what is going on. Where are you right now? Paris. I need to talk to someone. You know what? I'm in your house. Just drive home, okay? 
and drive safely. Fine, I'll meet you right there now, please. What's up, Jean? What happened? My father ruined my engagement party. How? What happened? He literally asked Perry to leave the house and never come back. <laughs> That's not possible. Your father I know cannot do such a thing. He asked me never to have anything to do with Perry. That is ridiculous. I mean, why? I mean, did you ask him why he said such thing? He didn't say anything. Wow. Um, look, Jim, I'll advise you to go and talk to your father in a calm manner. Who knows, he might tell you why he doesn't want you to marry Perry. My father, I know. Once he says, I'm done talking. He will never change his mind. Um, I know, Jim, look. Haven't you heard about the word that says there is no harm in trying? I mean, talk to him, confront him to know why he says so. I didn't you know what transpired between me and Jane. So I later found out that my father rejected her um, because she made it with his money. I just pray it's not related to this because I will be broken and Perry will not find it funny. And I think you have to go home and talk to your father. Sure, if you need to. Where is that? He's in the bedroom. Jim, please calm down. I beg you, calm down. Everything will be all right. Okay? Trust me. It's high time Dad stopped treating me like a child. It's okay. Just calm down. Dad. Young man. If you want us to talk about that promiscuous girl, I will not allow you to waste my time with it. Dad, I deserve to know why you don't want me to have anything to do with Perry. She is not the kind of woman you would want to take as a wife. I know her too well. She's my heart desire. You don't know her at all. You sound like you know her too well. Do you want to talk about it? Look, Jim. If I want to talk about that lady, it's certainly not today. Because it will only rile me up. How about my feelings? Well, it is better you feel terrible now than feel devastated in the future. This is the only time I brought a woman home. I've been a humble son to you and mom. But this one, I am going to disobey you if you don't tell me any tangible reason you don't want me to have anything to do with Perry. You try it. Try it, then I will disown you. I will ensure that you inherit nothing, nothing from me. Oh, this bossing has to stop that. Mark my words, young man. This bossing has to stop that for crying out loud. Is that kind of you, my man? Whatever choice I make in life, I have the right to take full responsibility for it. What is really going on? Until now, I don't know what is going on. 
Your father hasn't said anything reasonable to me. Just calm down. I will not calm down, Mom. I give him until tonight to tell me one reason I will not get married to Perry. I will take her to another city and get married there. It's all right. I will still talk to him. Just calm down. Everything will be fine. Trust me. What is really going on? Talking to me like I'm alive, not like I'm a child. Am I a child? No. You are not. Just calm down. I'll talk to him, okay? You're feeling bossy without telling me any tangible reason. Can you just sit down here and tell me I will marry the woman of my dreams just like that? Have I not been a, have, have I not been a good son to this house? Have I disobeyed you for once? So why can't you tell me what? Oh. Can you imagine that he's going, he's going to disown me for doing what exactly? For doing what exactly? That I demand to know, to know the reason I will not marry the woman of my dreams? Is that the only crime I committed? That is going to disown me? the best way. Can you please open this door, please? Go away. I don't want to spoil your mood. I don't want to talk to you. Just go. Go away. Go. Perry. Perry. If I leave here, I will never come back. Perry. Please, can you kindly open the door? Let's talk. Perry, I know you can hear me. Open the door, please. Perry! <laughs> Go away and never return. Never return again. Go! I don't want to talk to you. You can do and say anything you like. I don't care. All I know is I care. One good reason she's refusing to open the door. Is that the best approach? Oh my god. I, I hate my life right now. I hate today. I hate everything about myself. I hate my life. Just go! Go away. You can never, never walk. Just go away. Go. Very. Very, please. Stop doing this. Just open the door. Let's talk, please. No thanks. Even now, even now your husband is. Person from nowhere. Stranger, no. Person from nowhere. Come. Come they knock this door like this. How you feel? This company now, nah, I'm there. You get at me for this company. The man, the, you know like noise. Me personally, I know like noise. Try last night, I know sleep. I saw how they secure this company. They walk up and down. Small sleep where I won't sleep. Small sleep in the knock door. I don't want to vent my anger on you. I will advise you mind your business, which is the gate. Go have this compound, I be my business, so what do they pay me for? 
Go get live love. Go get live love. Live love. Come out. Come out. Make army person knock on now. Oga. Live love. Live love. A big. Oga. Oga, make I fix it. Oga, I'm in security for this company. I need to secure this company. If I don't secure this company, bro, I'm not going to come. Live love. This is serious. I mean, I'm thinking. Are you thinking what I'm thinking? What are you thinking? Look, Jim, it's only sugar daddies that behave like that. And moreover, your dad might just be sugar daddy to Perry. No. I don't think he's anything close to that. Come on, we are adults now. And moreover, can't you see the handwriting on the wall? You need to ask Perry some questions. Yes. No, no, it, it can't be. Uh, Perry is a decent girl. I believe if there's anything like that, she will tell me. Okay? No, no. That, that, that can't be possible. That can't be possible. Jim, these same girls are concubines. And concubines do not come from the pit of hell. Do not trust these girls. Me, I don't trust any woman. I don't expect one to trust me. Come on. Wait. Is that why my father said if I marry Perry, I will be devastated in life? Yes, Jim. Look, you need to ask her some questions. And you will find out what I'm thinking. I told you about my engagement party with Jean and the parents. Of course you did, yeah? I remember. <gasps> oh, I got there. Okay. Mom, I met face to face with a terrible past of mine. Face to face. What do you mean terrible <gasps> past of yours? Chief Williams is, is Jean's father. Chief Williams. Which Chief Williams? Chief Williams, the businessman. The oil will go. The CEO of Way Oil. He is. He is my, my man's father. What? Yes. Oh. Damn it. Damn it. Damn me. Like, damn. Damn it. I didn't even know what to do. I was so ashamed of myself. I couldn't even behold his face. He needed to have seen my face. It was as if the ground could open and swallow me. Ah! Oh, goodness. What have I gotten myself into? Oh. This might just be an opportunity for me to take my revenge on her. Why? Why would, why would this happen to me? Why? <laughs> G. 
shame. I don't want your mother to hear about what I want to discuss with you now. You see, a time comes in a man's life when the past comes knocking in the very fierce and embarrassing manner. Have you dated Perry before? She was a desperate career hustler. What does that mean? She was a marketer in her bank some years ago. And in a bid for her to meet the target set for her by her manager, we had one or two things together. Most marketers do that. I mean, that was in the past. Jim, if you listen to me carefully and allow me to finish, you will understand why you cannot marry that girl. Ah. <laughs> My pretty angel. Chief, good afternoon. Good afternoon. <laughs> you kept daddy waiting. I'm so sorry. The manager came, so I had to stay for an emergency. So what are you waiting for? This pretty thing. Devour daddy. Devour me to pieces. <laughs> I understand what you mean. Don't worry, okay? Let me quickly freshen up. And I'm so going to teach you a lesson that you will never forget in a hurry. Is that necessary? Very necessary. I'm, fe I'm feeling all sweaty. I need to, you know. You like it. <laughs> okay. They don't call it customer service for nothing. Because you must service the customer. If you want a big deposit, deposit you have to bring a sweet Baby, benefit. Baby, it's five minutes, so you are still there. Customer service. Please come, please come. Chief Odo, Mr. Williams, <laughs> met you again. <laughs> so, what about the belt? Ah, she's beautiful, man. Ah, she's there. <laughs> I'll see you tomorrow. Okay? okay? Yes. Make sure you take good care of her, all right? I'll do just that. Okay. But mind you, don't tell my wife that you saw me today. In fact, we never met. My friend. Go and get flogged thoroughly. <laughs> I'm ready to be flogged. <laughs> I wish you luck. <laughs> if I as it is right now, yes. I am completely finished. Go I can see. Go and have your dues. <laughs> <laughs> <It's not. laughs> Hello, pretty. Hi, good day, sir. Yes, you do. You're welcome. Thank you very much. Hello, pretty. Yeah. I heard your bank doesn't know that there are some big men in this town. Anyway, I don't normally introduce myself. But for the sake of business, I'll do that. Yes. But sir, you don't even need to do that. Your friend already told me a lot about you. I was here when he called you. So I'm fine with that. <laughs> really? Yes. But I don't think he must have told you everything. Or, or did he tell you that I am the CEO of Dodo Oil and Gas? No. Did he also tell you that I'm the chairman of Dodo Motors? And I'm very sure he also did not tell you that I have six big hotels dotted across the, the nation. Wow. <laughs> you are a bullion van. Oh. You can say that again. <laughs> and I'm very sure he also did not tell you that I'm the only billionaire that drives himself. Welcome to my world. Don't worry. You can say that again. again. But you can say, I will make sure you hit your target within three days. Oh my goodness. What are we talking about? You don't need to talk too much. Come to mama. Come to mama. Look at this. 
So you see, Jane, she did not only sleep with me, but with Odo, my friend, and several of my other friends. So tell me, is that the kind of girl you would want to marry as a wife? Every woman has a dated past, Dad. What makes you think the next woman won't be worse? Jim, the question is, is she the kind of woman you would like to take as a wife? Now, don't answer me now. I would want you to sleep over it till tomorrow. You give me your answer then. If your answer is yes, then count me out of it. And also count yourself out of my inheritance. Dad, this will be difficult for me to handle. that have been dumped the same way. Oh. They did not die. Rather, they picked up their pieces and they moved on. And oh. in your case, you yeah. have to do without to just pick any man of your choice and still make him to be under your control. That is not the kind of life I wish for. I love this man so much. I love him with everything I've got. I cannot afford to lose him and not now. For the very first time in my life, I'm falling so much in love. I can't lose him. I can't lose Jim. Love key you there. When you messed my life up, you didn't know I felt bad. Because Jim is every woman's dream. He's everything I've got. I don't even cheat on him because I love him so much. If I lose him now, I've lost everything. Like I'm so much in love. Oh goodness. I don't even know what to do. Can you listen to me? Oh. I honestly do not like what you're doing to yourself. You have cried enough. Okay? Listen. I wouldn't want you to kill yourself for what is not yours. She's mine! Jim is mine, how do you mean he's not mine? What if he's not meant to be yours? No, he is mine! He's just this past of mine! Oh goodness! Can you be calm? <gasps> tomorrow might be better. There is no hope for tomorrow without my Jim. There is no hope at all! There is no hope! Oh God, no, oh God, no, oh God, what have I done to myself? What has Monkey Job done to me? <laughs> what has Monkey Job done to my life? Okay, that's, <gasps> that's enough. Mm. Look at me. I want you to be calm and look right into my eyes. I'm talking to you, friend. I see nothing in the eyes. I see nothing. I want my gym. I, you. I want my gym. I want my gym. There's something you can do. Look at me, Jim. I deserve to 
know why you asked that girl to leave our house this afternoon. So tell me about it. I have discussed with Jim, and he understood. And that has not answered my question. Have you met that girl before? I mean, do you know her? Look, I have told you I don't want to discuss this girl. Okay? I don't want to talk about her. What is it about this girl that you don't want to talk about? I don't want our son to have anything to do with her. You can say whatever you like, but I will not talk about this girl. It is obvious you had something to do with her in the bus. Will yes. you stop? Please stop this this minute. Stop. Williams, it is you that should stop. Stop making me look stupid. Stop making me feel as if I don't exist, as if I'm not important in this house. Stop, William, stop. You should stop. Jim is not marrying that girl. And that is fine. Be able to learn nothing about her. But you should tell me about it. You must manage your customer. If you want to meet him, you better get up. It is customer service. It is important in banking. You, know. you are in business to make customer happy, so that they will come again. If you have to kiss them, kiss them. If they want to love them, love them. Money for hand, they back for ground. Can we go inside and talk? There is nothing to talk about. Nothing. Piri, we have to iron things out. But what difference does it make? Nothing. Piri, this is not the best approach. Can we talk about this, please? Can we stop talking about this? Because it won't change anything. Besides, you and I are not even going to get married, after all. So let's just move on with our lives. Did you just say that to me? But that's the truth. Please, I'm running late for work. Excuse me. They don't call it customer service for nothing. Because you must service the customer. If you want the big deposit, you have to bring the sweet benefit. Sweet benefit in business. Customer service, breast is for interest, nyash is for deposit, body for withdrawal, one no customer service. Auntie is a banker, working in the bank, breast is for interest, nyash is for deposit, body for withdrawal, one no customer service. Customer service, yo. you must service your customer.
morning. Chief, Chief, please, I beg of you. Anyhow, I must have done anything wrong. Forgive me. I beg you, please, don't do this to me. Perry, if you are here to beg me to allow you to marry my son, it is practically impossible. Oh, no. The answer is capital no. No, 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 no. I beg you, Chief. Please, I, I love your son so much. I love him. I love him. I love him with everything I've got. Please, I can't lose him at this time. I beg you, please. Perry, Perry. Sir. What you are asking is practically impossible. As long as I live. Now, if you want to marry anybody, go and look for those men out there that do not know anything about the kind of person you are. But certainly not my son. So I'm not a bad person. I was just a victim of circumstance because of the kind of work I do. I beg you, please. And when you're tired, you will leave my office. Please, I beg you. So I can't leave. I cannot leave if you don't if you don't give me any positive response. Please, I'm pleading. Oh, Perry, please leave. Leave my office. Please, leave my office. Please, leave. Please, leave. Leave. They don't call it customer service for nothing Because you must service the customer If you want a big deposit deposit You have to bring a sweet benefit Sweet benefit in business You need customer service Breast is for interest Nash is for deposit This is no time to cry This is a time for me to be brave I'm going to fight this with everything I've got. I can't lose my man. Not at this point. I won't let this man take my man away. I won't let that happen. I'm smart. I'm beautiful. I will fight this. Ma, your phone. Oh. Where, where did you get it from? I found it at the reception. Thank you. So this fine guest did die for chief. <gasps> what a world. Barry. Barry. You're a nice girl. But no same father will allow this. I will never allow this to happen. Never. Yes. Sir, I'm here to collect the file. What file are you talking about? You called me a few minutes ago to come and pick up a file. I called you a few minutes ago to come and pick up a file. And you are just coming. Look, I've told you severally that any time you want to come to my office, be sure of what you want. Alright? And this idea of you budging into my office any time a lady comes has to stop. You have to stop this madness. Is that understood? I'm sorry, sir. Good. What would you have for breakfast? I don't need anything. Go back to your work. Thank you, sir. Uh, come back. Now, let me warn you. If I hear anything about this lady from either my wife or my son, I will not hesitate to deal with you mercilessly. Is that understood? You are in business to make us stomach. Is for 
Wait, is Jim around? No, he went out. But well, Madame is inside. You can go inside and see her. Why don't you? Okay, she's here. Um, good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon. How are you? Ma, please, uh, I'm not fine. Ma, please, I've come to beg you to please talk to your husband on my behalf. I cannot lose the relationship I have with Jim. We've been in this relationship for a very long time. I can't afford to lose him. Please, ma. That is why I'm here. Go sit down there. Thank you, ma. Money for hand, the back of a ground. That is the game. In business, you need customer service. Breast is for interest. Nyash is for deposit. I want you at this point to tell me the truth. And nothing but the truth. What transpired between you and my husband? Ma, this might really sound annoying to you, but I will sure tell you the truth. Years ago, when I was still struggling in the bank as a marketer, I met your... That's something to do with my husband? Not really your husband. It was your husband's friend. Chief Odo. Little did I know that it will come hunting like this. I knew it has to do with this. At least it will serve as a lesson and deterrent as men that will hear your story. I mean, what would people say? We are a family of high pedigree. We will not tolerate any form of scandal with any member of our family. I'm sorry, my wasn't entirely my fault. The frustration from the bank was way too much. Please. Anyone in my shoes could have done the same, ma. Please, don't tell me that. People make choices, and you made your choice. I'm sorry, ma, but the truth is that the country is not making it any better for us. I will not take any insult from you. My husband has a good reason for his anger. I am not insulting you, ma'am. I'm only stating the obvious. Rubbish. Absolute rubbish. I am sorry, ma'am. But the truth is that we all have dirty slates and shits. I didn't intentionally do all those things I did because I wanted to. It just... was the pressure from the bank, please, ma'am. You just stated. You're just the kind of person you are. Don't say that rubbish again. That nonsense you're talking about. If you want the business to move up, it is customer service. Biggie bum bum, biggie deposit. Customer service, yo. You must service your customer. If you want to meet in your target, it is customer service. I can't talk. Sir, here is a file from Vintage Group of Companies. Uh, it's all right. Um, give it to Jim to sign. Uh, scan it and send it to them. Sir, so, um, Mr. Jim is not around. He's not yet in the office. You mean he has not come to work today? Yes, sir. Hmm. It's all right, you can go. Uh, come back, T take the fire. All right, sir.
this is this. Yes, what is it again? I'm sorry, sir. Someone is here to see you. But you can see that I'm busy. Now, tell the person to go and come back tomorrow. Please. It's your friend, Chief Odo. It's all right. Tell him to come in. All right, sir. such a thing for me. Knowing fully well that I do not have a soul. What are you talking about? I met a lady some hours ago and she told me everything. I am still confused here. What are you talking about? You met a lady, yes? What did she tell you? I went to have breakfast. So, and a lady walked in. They don't call it customer service for nothing. Because you must service the customer. If you want a big deposit, deposit yeah. you have to bring a sweet benefit. Sweet benefit in business. You need customer service. Breast is for interest. Nash is for deposit. Hello, Chief. Have I met you before? Of course not. But I bring you good news I know you would love. Yes. News about your son. My son? <laughs> I don't have a son. Oh, I see. So your mistress who works with the bank did not tell you she had a son for you? My mistress? Yes. Who? Wait. That is not even a problem. For she never told me she was even pregnant from me. Oh. Uh. Well, I am certain you are not aware of it. But if you think I am lying, you can confirm from your friend Chief Williams. And if you also think she's a saint, I can take you to where you will find her and that of your son. Are you sure of what you are saying? Of course, Chief. I cannot just come here to tell you some cheap lies. Ha. I can't do that. Be very, very careful. Because if I find out that you are telling lies, you won't believe what will happen to you. Believe her at your own peril, Chief. They don't call it customer service for nothing. Because you must service the customer. If you want a big deposit, deposit yeah. you have to bring a sweet benefit. Sweet benefit in business. You need customer service. Breast is for interest. So near. So near. And I think there is an element of truth in what she said. I need my soul. I want my soul. I cannot allow her to keep my child. This lady is evil. Chief Odo, I want to get something clear. You met a total stranger who told you that Peru was pregnant for you and you believed her? I believed her because Peru disappeared for one year and later resurfaced. Can you see the connection? That girl is evil. Chief Odo. Yes. I have my doubt. Yes. Because Perry is too outspoken to keep such a secret. I mean, if she was pregnant for you, she would have come to you to ask for money. You know Perry. You don't know these girls. They can be very desperate. That girl. 
might decide to keep the child. Well, if you feel so strongly about it, then uh, I think you need to contact her and ask some relevant questions. What questions do I ask her? And where do I even see her? You are in business to make customer happy So that they will come again If you have to kiss them, kiss them they want to Dan, I know you will find this funny But it's not a man has to come to the realization that sometimes he disobeys some elders to get himself free. You don't even get it. The worst mistake we make sometimes is staying in the same house with our parents. That's the same... Let me call you back. Let me call you back. What are you doing sitting at home? You didn't show up at the office today. I called your line severally and you chose to ignore my course. Why? Simply because I'm taking a break. You are taking a break. Do you know how much we lose because of this, your incessant taking of breaks? Do you know how much on a weekly basis? Don't act like you don't know I'm heartbroken. Why are you behaving like a baby? You are heartbroken simply because I saved you from the claws of a slut. Oh, she's not a slut! People like you and your friends are the reason girls in her situation go under the sheet to meet their targets. You cheated a mom too. You are damn slut too! Are you mad? How dare you? How dare you call me a slut? Are you not? I will not hesitate to deal with you mercilessly if you don't get your manners coupled. Idiot! I know. I know you're my father. But don't you hit me again. And if I do, what will you do? Fight me? No, 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 you want to fight me? Don't you hit me again. It's not good for anybody. I told you I will use that strategy later. But you don't even know what I'm up to yet. Mm. Allow me to be done first. Listen, these people need to rip from their past as well. This will unearth a lot. And it's going to go messier. Nothing is going to go messier, Perry. I mean, men shouldn't make it look like having sex with a lady makes her rotten or something. Let this past knock on everyone's door. Babes, I hate scandals a lot. You don't know what I'm talking about. Of course I know what no, you're babes, talking about. No, don't. It brings so much hate and enmity. It's unfathomable. 
Can you listen to me? There is only one way to get yourself out of this mess. Which is? You don't have to care about what anybody says or thinks about you. You just have to do what needs to be done. Signing, you give them to the secretary to scan and send to our client. I told you I'm on break. I am not signing anything. You mean you want us to lose a multi-million naira contract just because of a woman? She is not just a woman. Let me marry her. She's my heart. I can leave your house for you. In fact, you can disown me, but let me marry her. It's very simple. Jane, you want to marry a woman that already has a child for another man? What did you say? You heard me right. Oh, you mean she didn't tell you? <laughs> Perry didn't tell you that she has a child for Chief Odo? Oh, you're surprised. Is that the kind of woman you want to marry? A woman with a terrible past? I don't know. That can be true. Perry does not have a child. Better believe it, Jim. As a child. But you've owed her. Can't marry her. Deceived me. I thought I knew you. I thought I found the love of my life. So you were a chameleon. What are you talking about? I mean, where is this coming from? Why are you calling me names? Because you know exactly what I'm talking about. So this is how you are. How? What have I done? Okay, you stop being dramatic because you know exactly what I'm talking about. Then tell me what is it? 
You had a child for Chief Odo. Why didn't you tell me? Excuse you? Why did you hide it from me? What? Who gave you such false information? That's not true. That's a fat lie. My father was right after all. You lie a whole lot. Ha! Huh. You are nothing but a slut. No! I don't want to see you anywhere close to me. Don't talk to me like that. Hey! to my relationship. Friend Perry. Can I find that girl? I want to find her. I need to. Because I want my child. Ah. Odo, why did you bring this matter here? Huh? Don't you know that my wife can hear about it? And if she hears, forgotten issues may crop up. Look, Odo, you need to learn how to. Handle this issue maturely. Why are you this all emotional about it? We're talking about my son here. My blood. My first son whom I've not set my eyes on. I need to find that girl and pay her off if possible. And you think that she lives here, right? Eh? Huh? Look, I don't know where she lives, and I don't want to talk about her. Let me warn you, though. This should be the last time you will ever bring this issue to my house again. Do you understand me? Where is your son? I want to talk to him myself. I cannot rest if I don't do the right thing. And you think the right thing? Is for you to come to my house for investigation? Is this a police station? My house looks like a, a, an investigation room to you? Look, I don't know where my son is. Williams, you need to help me. You know my condition. I would be happy if I can find my son. Look, Odo, you are getting me angry. Look, I don't want to lose it. Enough of this. What is it? They don't call it customer service for nothing. Because you must service the customer. If 
Where do you think you're going? What are you doing here? I just feel like running away where no one will see me. I feel terrible right now. I feel used. I feel betrayed. I hate to feel this way. Come on, Jean. Oh, you're drinking too much, man. Is it a crime to love? Why would Perry lie to me about her past? Why? Look, I understand the whole thing. But we need to leave here before we appear in newspaper tomorrow with a different caption. Come on. I'm not getting up from here. Come on. You're very funny. You know I can't leave you here. Come on, let's go. Where will I find this girl now? I must find her, no matter what it is. You all have not seen anything yet. When I come out with my next episode, everywhere will burn to ashes. And when all of this is over, I, Sonia, will laugh last. Me, um, when you made me lose a target 
set of five million naira from Chief Williams and snatched him from me. Did you ever remember in your miserable life that a day like this would come? <laughs> so this is what all this charade is all about. About Chief Williams. Sonia, do not forgive me, Charles. Hello, Chiki. Beautiful Sonia. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. Good afternoon, sir. My friend and my colleague as well. Her name is Perry. Perry, hey. good afternoon, sir. Hey! How are you? I'm fine, sir. Hello, Chi. Can you take it easy? She's a special somebody. Come on. That is why I'm holding her in a very special way. Eh? Are you jealous? Come off it, Chi. I am not. Very <laughs> good. Sonia. I mean, you can't come to daddy and still be complaining of hunger. No. Eh? Okay, right. If you don't like this place, eh? I can take you to a Chinese restaurant or any restaurant of your choice. Chinese restaurant? Harry, did you hear that? <laughs> I am ready. Let us go. I like their meal. Um, mm -hmm. why don't we leave it some other time? Besides, Food is food, and theirs is very expensive. Come on, Perry. I wouldn't want you to have pity on Chi. He has the money and he's ready to spend it, okay? Please tell her. Tell her that I am money. Anyway, Chinese restaurant is it. You don't call it customer service for nothing. Because you must service the customer. If you want the big deposit, Chief, Ooh. you look like an old man from the outside. But in the inside, you're just like a 20 years old boy. <laughs> Very strong. You are the bomb, Chief. You can say that again. But you see, a man is as strong as a woman that he is beholding. Mm. You know, for a beautiful lady like you, there is no way I would not be a horse. <laughs> <laughs> but to tell you the truth, Chief, if you were not a married man, hmm. I would have proposed to you myself. Well, <laughs> please, stop flattering me. I am not flattering you, Chief. I'm telling you the truth. Really? Honestly. Hmm. Mm. It's all right. Um, uh, how much did you say is your target again? Okay, Chief, it's um, 20 million naira. Ordinary 20 million naira? Yes, Chief. It's 20 million, and I have just one way to get to my target. But 10 million could go. But if I don't get any of these, I may lose my job. Or at the end of the day, I may not even get my salary. It's that bad. Yeah, she's for the positive body for me, the wrong one. Customer service. Customer service. You must service your customer. This is how terrible Perry can be. Such a terrible friend. Perry. We shall see how the laughs last. Or better still, we shall see who cries last. I am not going to give you 10 million. Not me. My chief, please. I beg you, help me. Help me. I'm at your service anytime, any day. I have not finished talking. Okay, Chief. I will give you 20 million. What? <gasps> Chief, thank you so much. <laughs> what? If at any time you want me, morning, afternoon, night, evening, even in the midnight, I'm ready for you. Really? <laughs> Chief. You want to completely finish I me will again? finish you. <laughs> Thank you, Chief. Uh, well, anything for my baby. Thank and, you. As a matter of fact, okay. I'm going to give you other clients. Yes, there is this particular one, Chief Odo. 
Okay. Uh, I'm sure he's going to open account with you. With huh. Five million. Oh, yes. Chief, what would I have done without you? You're such an amazing man. Thank you so much. You know what? <laughs> yes. Come have some sugar. Uh, let me rest, please. Come on. Let me rest. Come on. You're a strong man. Uh, just tell me you want to finish me. What, what is wrong with that? Let me give you some sugar. I'm already completely finished. Mm. Huh? It's okay if you insist. <laughs> well, um, let me be going. Breast is for interest. such a way that suicide will be the only option you have left. Perry, I will make life a living hell for you. Perry, I will do all of this still smiling and pretending to be a friend since that is the new game. I will make life so difficult for you. I, Sonia, will teach you a lesson you will never forget till the day you die. I will deal with you so much that even in death, you will not forget and forgive me. It's a promise. I will deal with you. Customer service you. You must service your customer. If you want the business to move, it is customer service. Fine body. Yes, come in. Good morning, Chief. What's that? Oh, yeah. Of course. This one, your face is like this. Are you okay? Chief, I am not fine. You are not fine? Yes. What's the problem? I have just one week to meet up with my target. Hmm. I don't want to lose my job, please. You know that if I don't meet up with it, I'll be fired. And I don't want that to happen. So, um, what do you plan to do? Chief, the last time I saw you, you promised to open an account with me. Ooh. Making a deposit of 5 million naira. Honestly, that will go a long way. I'm begging you. Well, uh, I remember vividly that uh, I promised you. But you see, I spent a lot this period. I invested a huge sum of money on my farm, the new farm that I acquired. and. Uh, Right now, I really don't have much to invest in your bank, so I'm sorry. Um, can I come back on Thursday? I equally invested a lot in my oil business, and the return on investment is not something that I expect so soon. So you see, I really don't have much on me anymore. 
I'm she sorry. I'm begging you. Please. For the sake of everything that you hold sacred. For the sake of my sick mother, I am begging you to assist me. I don't want to lose my job. I don't want to... Hey, look, 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 young lady, as you can see, I'm a very busy person. I don't want us to discuss this issue any further. So if you don't mind, please, excuse me. Chief, please. They don't call it customer service for nothing. Because you must service the customer. If you want the big deposit, deposit you have to bring a sweet benefit. Please, benefit. will you excuse me? I'm busy. You need customer service. Rest is for interest, nyash is for deposit, body for withdrawal or customer service. Auntie is a banker, walking in the bank. Breast is for interest, nyash is for deposit, body for withdrawal or customer service. Customer service, yo. you must service your customer. the new girl. Her needs are now being taken care of. Why all I hear is stories upon stories. We're just about calling your number. Sir, I actually woke up with a test from my manager. You know what that means. Speak no more. <laughs> Please sit down. Mm -hmm. I said sit down and make yourself comfortable. Okay, sir. So, who is your manager to get you worked up this early morning? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's all right. Um, you will meet your target, okay? As a matter of fact, you will set more targets. Thank you very much, sir. Yes. I'm a man of my words, <sighs> and I keep them. Thank you so much, all sir. Right? Let me fill forms. Oh, thank <laughs> you, sir. You won't regret this. They don't call it customer service for yeah. Because you must service the customer. Uh, so, how much did you say? 15 million? No, you actually said 20 million. Oh, 20? Yes, sir. <laughs> okay, so thank you. Yes, sir. Breast is for interest. Nyash is for deposit. Body for withdrawal. No customer service. Auntie is a banker. Working in the bank. Breast is for interest. Nyash is for deposit. Body for withdrawal. No customer service. Customer service, you. you must service your customer. If you want the business to move, oh, it is customer service. You have to satisfy customer. Customer service, you, you must service your customer. If you want to meet your target, oh, it is customer service. It is important in banking, you know. 
You are in business to make customers happy mm. So that they will come again If you have to kiss them kiss If them. they want to love them love the Money them. for hand, they back for ground oh, That is the game In business, you need customer service Breast is for interest Nyash is for deposit Body for withdrawal oh, Customer service Auntie is a banker Walking in the bank Breast is for interest, nyash is for deposit, body for withdrawal, oh, customer service, customer service, yo. you must service your customer, if you want the business to move, oh, it is customer service, biggie bum bum, biggie deposit, yo. customer service, yo. you must service your customer. If you want to meet in your target, it is customer service. Account office and service the customer. Customer service, you, you must service your customer. If you want the business to move, oh, it is customer service. Find money, find money. Girl, you know, today has been a good day. Guess what? Yes! Okay, I'll tell you. I met this man, good looking man, and then we got talking. At the end of the day, he opened a savings account of 20 million naira with me! Girl! I am super excited. I am done panicking. I am done receiving insults from that ugly manager of ours. Like literally, I am done! Woo! I'm super excited! What is it? You look withdrawn. Is there a problem? Hey, talk to me. What is the problem? Chief used me and dumped me. Chief. Who in God's name is Chief? Wait, is it that old man we met the other day at the bar? Yes. God, you slept with him? Come on, darling, you shouldn't have. I mean, I can't even imagine myself under the same sheet with that man. Well, oh, sorry about that. How, how did it happen? We met in his hotel last week. Okay. So he asked that I come back today. On getting there, he said he can no longer assist me because he invested in his oil business. I don't know. How am I supposed to? What am I supposed to do now? Sorry about what happened. We just have to calm down, okay? Calm down? Yeah, keep it down. How can you ask me to calm down when you know I have just one week? One week to raise five million naira. Where am I going to get that from? <laughs> what would you have me say? You should go up? I'm your friend and I should give you the best advice, which is to calm down. Calm down and walk towards it. I'm sure by God's grace you'll get the money. I mean, even what happened today is like a miracle to me. I never expected it. Okay? So keep it down, darling. I am scared. I don't know what to Why do. Why are you scared? I don't know. About the money? Of course! Just try. Work harder. God will do it, okay? Hmm. Mm -hmm. It's fine, please don't be like that. Hello, Chima. Yes. 
What? Mama is what? Okay. There's no problems. I'm ready. Alright. What is wrong with your mother? My mother is sick. So sorry. So sorry, darling. Oh, I mean, I know, listen, I know this is really a tough time for you. The target, your mom's sickness. But please, I'm losing it. You don't have to. You don't have to. I'm Just keep it down. It. Sorry. It's okay. Money to take you to the hospital. Hey. Please, you just have to eat your food okay. so that mm. Mama, the golden leaf, okay. just eat steak. Mama, if you don't take your food, how would the drugs work now? Mm -mm. Hi, Mama, just mm. take one spoon. Take our food, though. Mm. 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 Mama. 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 First, do you know anybody? Mama needs to be taken to the hospital. Mm -hmm. No problem, no problem. Eh? I, I don't know. I don't know anywhere you can borrow money from. I, I don't know. What was in the same game? Eh? But you should have come with money now. Eh? I saw you and I was happy. Oh my 
want to do. That's what I'm still thinking. I don't thinking. want anything to happen to Mama. I didn't see you today at the office. Or you left quite early. What's going on? You're crying. What's the problem? You don't talk to me. What is it? I hope nothing is wrong with your mother. I lost my job. You lost good job? For what? What happened? I wasn't even aware of it. No one told me anything. Is it because of the target? I couldn't believe. Oh, so sorry, my darling. I don't know what to do. Oh, these people are so mean. How callous of them. I mean, is that enough reason for you to have been relieved of your job? I'm sorry. What am I going to do? God is not asleep. I am confused. Why would people do this? <laughs> Why would they do this at this time? Critical time. Eh? How mean. Sorry, dear. Flying? Yes, darling. To where? To London. I will be traveling to London. Hold on. <laughs> I just want to understand you right. Okay. Who is taking you? Our bank. They are sending myself and three other people to London for studies. Girl, I am so excited. Wow. Yeah. London Bridge is falling down. It should be. <laughs> yes, darling. I'm so happy. Of course, I worked for it. I earned it. Yeah, you oh, did. Oh, congratulations. Thank I... you. Bro. You know, I've never traveled all my life. It's just been this normal travel. But this time around, London. It's a big deal. And to make matters worse, you were sent to Switzerland and London while I got fired. All thanks to you, I am a marketer in a common microfinance bank. Sonia, if you, if you haven't lost your sanity, I am sure you would remember that you categorically told me that you have nothing, absolutely nothing to do with Chief Williams. So why are you so bitter? Why? What did you just say? You aren't daft, are you? You are the daft and the mean one. Exactly you. You came back from London. You got promoted. You never even thought it wise to help me. I almost lost my mother. I lost everything. Did you ever thought it wise to offer me a job in your bank? No, you did not. And now, you want to marry Chief William's son? This is really terrible. This is a complete act of witchcraft. You! I call you my friend. And you, you did this to me? Listen, like I said, Sonia, do not forgive betrayals. It's payback time. You deal with it. <laughs> hey, no, 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 like no. No, this is not happening. Someone should just wake me up from this dream because it's as if I'm. Oh no, 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 this is not happening. Oh, this girl is a witch. No, no, she told me she has nothing with the man. No, 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 no. Where are you? 
You just told me you were very close to the place and this is the second time I'm coming out. But I know they see you now. Where are you? I'm going to come out now. I'm tired of standing here. Got, I, I'll go inside though. What's all this? Do may you come. I'll not get time again. I've been here. I get some things I'm supposed to do inside. I beg, I beg, come, eh? Yeah? I'm so sorry, please. I'm sorry. Sorry. Uh, how are you? I'm fine. Nice shirt. Oh. It's Nigerian made. Yummy casual. Oh, so, I see. you mind if I have your digits? I would rather have your card. My card. Has an iceberg. Thank you. <laughs> Christian, and I want you to be honest with me. Do you love her like before? Do you? I still love her. If you love her, you have to do something. I mean, forget about her past. I love her like never before. The only way to prove to my father that I love Perry is to disobey him and marry her. Like at this point, I don't care anymore. No, Jim. I'm with you on this one. In fact, you can take her to UK. I'm where they're over there. I'm strongly beside you. Tell me what the problem is. I don't want to talk about it. Perry, I will not leave here until you tell me what got into that terrible mood. Talk to me. Forgive me. Your past can never tear us apart. To love you. Boyfriend? <laughs> Talk to me. Stop! 
Stop it! Stop it! It's okay, it's okay. Let's calm down. Oh, sorry. Let go! Come to me! Calm down, we're gonna let something out. Okay, calm down. We'll okay, sort it out. Sign the documents so that we can secure the contract. You see, this contract is a very big one. It's not something we should miss. Look, son. There comes a time in a man's life when he forgets about worldly pleasures and focuses on building and securing his future. It baffles me that you, you went haywire because of a girl with a rotten past. Why? I'm not ready for this, please. Look, son. Our company is a big one. A very big one at that. You need to queue behind the legacy we've built over the years so that you can move the company to the next level. And that is the level of making it a world-class company. That way, you don't need any introduction before our investors. Look, son. We need this contract. Can you stop talking to me about legacy? Being faithful to your wife is legacy. Not taking advantage of a poor, helpless girl before helping her reach her target is legacy. The only legacy you care about is money. Stop, son! Just talk. You can't possibly be talking to me in such a disrespectful manner. I am not. I am not done talking, Father. What stopped you from helping Perry when she came to you to help her meet her target? Why didn't you help her without having sex with her? Look, just stop this minute. Just shut up. Shut up. You cheated on Mom. Not once. Not twice. And you're here talking to me about legacy. Bravo! That legacy. Bravo! Williams? I regret ever setting my eyes on you. My instinct has never failed me. It was right after all. I spit on that trust I ever had on you. I spit on that trust. I spit on you. Because it's in the past now. You have to bury me before you bring them into this house. Shame. Shame on you. You disgust me. You see what you have caused? You see what your careless thoughts have caused? Go and sort it out with your legacy. Go and jubilate. It's yours. Who is that? Don't 
Don't you dare come close to me. One inch. Don't you dare. One step. I will do it. Please, calm down. Calm down, please. Uh, let me explain. I'm, I'm ready to tell you everything, please. Drop that thing. I've been a fool all this while. I've been a fool to you all this while. I've been a faithful wife to an unfaithful husband, to an unfaithful man. Yeah. Such an ungrateful man. <laughs> Only please, please, calm down. I, I want to explain. <laughs> I want to confess, I will tell you everything. Give me the chance to explain. <laughs> you see, please, I'm not a bad husband though. I will, I will explain, please. I am sorry. Williams, don't you ever open your mouth to say that to me. Because you are not sorry. Even if you are, is he going to clean up this field? This mess you created with sorry cleaning. So what will sorry do? No sorry heal sicknesses. Will he heal my heart? Will he heal the pain I am going through right now? Will sorry change anything? I'm sorry. I, 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 I mean it. I mean it. I'm sorry. <laughs> you are not. If you were, you wouldn't have done everything you did. Don't you dare. Don't you dare come close to me. Else I would do something stupid. Don't you dare. Don't you just dare. It's me. Who are you? You're filthy, you are dirty. You are nothing. <laughs> Williams, you are nothing. You went too far. Can you imagine what your lack of self-restraint and careless talks can cause to your mother's earth? Did you ever think about that? Um, so, sign the documents. I will not append my signature on this document. Not after all you did to Perry and I. Jim, I don't want to repeat myself again. I'm telling you for the last time, sign those documents. I see you think I'm joking, right? Think about walking out on me. Don't! Dad, I'm embarrassed. I will advise you on the bush, Father.
very sorry. I, I want to confess. I, I did it just once. I swear, I will never try it again. It will never happen again. Please. Williams. Williams, you got me infected. Yet you denied it. You were in this house. I was moving from one hospital to the other, looking for solution. You didn't in any way show any form of remorse or care. You were so adamant, you were so on your own, you didn't care about it, yet you knew what I was going through. <laughs> I, I feel really terrible right now. Sorry. Who is the girl? The secretary? Uh, honey, please. Let's not talk about the girl. I want to know who the girl is. Let's not talk about it. Did I wake you up? Hello, and who is this that flatters me at this time of the night? Sonia. Sonia? Sonia is the young lady you almost pushed down today at the bar. <sighs> Sonia. I'm fine, I'm fine. And how are you? Do you mind if we we'll have a, a cosy, you I mean a cosy date tomorrow? I mean, some nice sit out. And, you know, get to familiarize. A date? Of course. Okay, 2 p.m. is cool. Wow, that was splendid. Thanks for accepting my offer. <laughs> okay, good night. Appreciate. Okay, good night. Good night. Yeah. To fix everything that has broken in this family. Please. Williams, tell me. Why do men derive pleasure in having lots of women outside their marriage? Give me one reason you did that. Honey, please. Let us not talk about that. I am a changed person. Everything about my past is thrown away. Can't you see? In your interest, I have to make peace with your son. Well, I am ready to do everything or anything to make you happy. Thank you.
Why has he refused to take my call? Your mom and I have decided to fix the issues we are having tonight. Um, we want you to please calm down so that we can talk. Right? But before then, we want you to sign these documents because the contract is very important for this family. Jim, please, calm down. I beg you, calm down. I, I, I was the person that was hurt. But I've let go, so that peace can reign again in our home. I just want us to let go. I'm tired of the crisis. Aren't you tired? Have we been like this before? Let go. Do anything that can bring us back together again as a family. Sign this document for us. You mean to tell me that this document is more important than my happiness? No. Are you for real now, Mom? Even you. Gosh, you're going to get it. Gosh, Jim! He doesn't seem to understand the importance of this contract. Eh? I mean, the, the contract, the, the, the sum is huge. Why is it like this? Hey, oh, this contract. I mean, how can a total stranger cause hatred between us? Huh? Dad, this discussion or peace talk or whatever thing you call it will not make sense if you don't tell me when we are going to see Paris people. That's the only thing I want to hear now. Can you please calm down? Mom, please, can you stop telling me to calm down? If you know what's going on, you will not be telling me to calm down. In fact, I'm out of this place. Did you see that? From a meeting that I called to resolve issues. I think that girl must have given my son something I cannot explain. Have you had any problem with Jim that I'm not aware of? But you know me now. If I had any issues with him, I would have told you. Huh? I think he's enraged because I stopped him from marrying that girl. But why is it difficult for you to tell me exactly what that girl did? Or has she worked for you before? 
Um, well, if I must tell you, she forged my signature. Yes, she forged my signature and collected a contract that I was supposed to get from a Chinese company. What? Yes. Is that fraud? Oh. Is that the kind of girl you want her son to marry? Your son Jim was here a few days ago. And he was complaining bitterly that you refused him to marry a girl of his choice. Mazi, we settled that issue yesterday night. I made him to understand why he cannot marry that girl. And uh, I'm sure he understood. If he did, he wouldn't have called me very early this morning and complaining bitterly more than before. So I, I want to ask a few questions. Go ahead. Who is this girl? Is her family cost? Does the sanity run in their lineage? Or what is the problem? Mazi, uh, this issue is not uh, something we should discuss right now. You know, uh, the truth of the matter is that I've made up my mind. He will never marry that girl. And nothing will change that. The, the truth is that that girl is not the type of girl that he can marry. And I've made up my mind and nothing can change that. That girl is not the kind of girl that can come into our family, let alone answer our son. This may be very serious. Of course it's serious. Let me guess. Guess what? You may have had something with that girl in the past. I don't think that is enough reason to reject her. <laughs> Mazi, you don't know this girl. This is a girl that didn't just sleep with me alone. She slept with several of my friends. As a matter of fact, she, she had a baby with one of my friends. What? Oh. That is unacceptable. There's no way she can be part of this family. No. I think uh, uh, Jim need to think. Oh. You, see, you see my point now. We need to talk to Jim. Just think. No, 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 no. Jim. So, it has gotten to the point where my son will report me to Marzi. If I don't show him the stuff I am made of, he will not pick up the bag of wisdom. He needs to ask questions about what I am capable of doing. It's alright. We shall see. to marry a woman that will share your bed with your servant whenever you are away? Uncle, all I can see here is that he came to you and he lied to you. He made up stories and you believed him. But let me tell you this so you can tell him. If I don't marry that girl, I will wait for him to die before I get married. How can you say such a thing? Huh? Kindly tell him what I just said. Because I'm not joking. I'm not joking. Oh, okay. 
son. Hello. We go to the dining to have our meal there. I would love to have the meal with you here. I mean, I enjoy having meal on the bed. Ah. Mm. <laughs> you know I'll do anything for you. <laughs> Wait. What? Don't you want to eat anymore? Even when you know she has my son with her. I'm talking to you, Jim. Where are you hiding her? I'm not here for jokes. Where is she? Chifodo, I wouldn't want to vent my anger on you. Stay away from me. I will raise my hand on you if you don't get out of my sight. Are you out of your mind? Don't get me angry. Not enough to threaten me. Have you forgotten who I am? Or have your father not told you who I am? Of course I know who you are. You are the old man that goes around sleeping with girls young enough to be your daughters. An irresponsible husband of a good wife. That is who you are. Now, have you asked my father who I am? I can be very mad when I'm angry. Get out! Get So heartless. <laughs> Wonderful. Oh, Mr. William and his son wants to play fast one on me. It will not happen. Over my dead body, will I allow him to marry Perry? When my son is still not with me, I've not gotten that son. It will not happen. No matter what. No sense. Good afternoon, sir. You look good. Oh, thank you. Yes. <laughs> Chuma, yeah? please, can you get him a chair so he can sit? I will. I will. Just a moment. Hey! So, brother, it's lively. Yeah. <laughs> See, younger or elder? Elder brother. Elder brother. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> hey! 
said this is Tony my special friend um, he's asking for my hand in marriage <laughs> yes mama that is the reason I I asked him to come and see you because he's saying he'll be coming to see you with his people by next week Mm. Yes, Mama. Mama, where are you from? Mm, I'm from uh, Abalobodo, in the Lukwa East local government area of Delta State. Yeah. You're welcome once again. Thank you very much, Mama. Um, Sonia. Mama. I'm so bad area. I have to go inform your uncle. He knows how to tell his king's men. You know? Yes, Mama. I'll do just that. Uh, so bad, man. I was working in the kitchen. Hmm? Let me quickly finish what I was working in the kitchen. Come on, Kine, see, Mama. Oh, see, come. 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 When did you? Oh, see, come. Mama, I'm not going to be here. Thank you very much, man. Wow, well, your mom is lively, too. Yeah, well, that's, that's how we live here. I can see that. <laughs> um, honey. Mm. You're welcome to my home. Thank you. So, shall we? Okay. Oh. Jim, I have spoken with your father and he has allowed you to marry Perry. I don't love her anymore. You don't need to be angry with the poor girl. Come on. Shuffle your pride under the, under the bed and go make peace with her. You will not understand, Mom. The feelings has died. I don't even want to talk about getting married now. I just want to make my own money. 
Jean, I want you to reconcile with that girl. She has suffered enough. I know this because I'm a woman. I know what she'll be going through now. That girl loves you genuinely. I know that. I met her with another man. Really? Did you, did you catch them all under the sheet? Mm, not really, but um, I met them cuddling upon each other, melting into his arms and stuff. What else? And that proves to you that she has found someone else. Mom, I don't care anymore, right? I, I just don't care. I, I just, I just want to reset my brain right now. What's another man doing in her house, if not something else? You know you have not been there for some time. Just take things easy with her. Banker. Yes. Why? She know they're around. She travel. She what? She travel. Is that a joke? Ha. Oh God, they play. And they run around. She don't travel. At least not only me, they're around. When? Now nah, that is question don't tire me. Like this, as I wake up for morning time, they say and they carry box, move. Now leave me there. Oh, no. did, did, did she tell you where, where no, she was no, going? No, she, no, she not tell me. She not tell me. Maybe you go. She not tell me, miss. Did she tell you no. when, when she's likely to come just back? Any, I just all those things are personal information. I don't know. I just go make her, make her do something. It's in the morning time, so I need to tidy this compound. Now only me they do all this job. Make her the clothes on. No vexation. You get some money for me. All right, get some money for me. Hey! All these fine boys. I saw they come find madam for this compound. Not, nothing they drop for me. Nothing come out. You are losing our stay in this house. Why do you want to leave me all alone again in this house? No, please. Nothing is going to keep me in this house in the next five minutes. I want to leave this house for good. I want to go out there and build my life, make my own money and marry whoever I want to marry. Jim, you're hurting your mother. Don't you think so? Please stay with your husband. This is not fair. I don't want to know, Mom. I don't care. Please. I want to go out there and build my own life, build my own empire. I just noticed I, I, I could have done that a long time ago. But I'm staying here. Mom, please, don't, 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 don't even do that. Uh, Jim. Jim. Where are you going carrying the bag? It's none of your business. I'm leaving your house for good. You can do whatever you want to do with it. I'm going out there to build my own empire. I'm now a man. My friend, go and keep that bag inside. Please. Jim, stop! Stop! Jim, stop him! What is wrong with you? Huh? 
What's wrong with you? You said you wanted to marry Perry. Fine. If you must, marry her. But stop this childish behavior. Huh? Have you seen what your stubbornness has caused? Have you seen that? Don't let anything happen to my son. I repeat, don't let anything happen to my son. Hey, look, stop this blaming thing. Eh? I'm only doing what a good father will do for any son to save his future. Eh? And I repeat, don't let anything happen to my son, else you won't enjoy this house. Let's go inside. Let's go. Oh my God. Talk to me. Perry. What kind of thing is this now? Ah, you blind, you want to phone me? I'm sorry, it wasn't done on papers. I'm just trying to make a call. Yeah, yeah, sorry. See the way you're saying yeah, yeah, sorry. I never believed that things would turn out this way, Mama. My past came haunting me so badly. It was as if I'm losing my mind. I had no option, Mama. Because this is the only place I could I can find peace. <sighs> my daughter. You have to be strong. In as much as I'm happy that you are now a big woman in the bank. I'm also worried things like this can deny you an opportunity of getting the right man. Well, I cannot start blaming you. You have to be strong. You have been a strong woman. Please, you have always been my daughter. Please, please. Seeing your tears like this breaks my heart. That is why I decided to come back home. To be stronger than I ever have. Because I don't have a choice right now, Mama. I just... I just... My daughter, you will not stay here. Staying here will make you break down. Hey? You have to go back to work. You go back to work, you see different people, you attend to them, you keep strong. It will keep you strong. Please. Mama, I can't go back there for now. I took an emergency medical leave. That is why I'm here. Hi. I need to be fine. I need to be fine, Mama. Hi. I'm losing my sanity. If you say so, my daughter, 
You have lost weight. Let me get you something to eat. Mama, I'm not hungry. You have to eat. You have to take something. Eh? I'm not hungry. You have to eat. I'm not hungry. I'm not hungry. <laughs> house. She don't tell me now. She pack her out. I don't want her uh, own personal information. Where did she go to? I don't know. How, how am I going to reach her now? Eh? That means you will call her on phone now. You find any way to reach her. Her number is switched off. I've been trying it. I beg her to cook something for fire now. Before you, if you come out, you will, you will help me lock this gate. I beg if you come out, just help me lock the gate. Something here for fire. Don't tell me that she was packing out of her house. Hey, oh my, oh my, I go come one chance. I did not bring enough money to the city. Am I going to go back now? This, this kid's man that is very stubborn. You say. Mumba switched off. Eh? Switched off and and then. You must have this your customer. If you want to meet your target, it is customer service. It is important in banking. You are in business to make customer happy so that they will come again. If you have to kiss them, kiss them. If they want to love them, love them. money for hand, they back for ground. Is a scam. Hmm? I'll never fall in love again. In my life. I'll never fall in love again. to ask? Will you leave me alone? Go away. Go! Go away. It's alright, but I... I just want to say... 
I'm sorry. that I will bring him back tomorrow. Don't say one more word. I do not want to hear your voice. Just keep quiet. Your voice irritates me. Do I need to shout it before you understand that? Please, anytime you're close to me, shut up. Don't say anything. You're better when you're silent.
finished. Finished. And finished. Someone's money because of transport. Eh? What kind of demon possessed you? It's better I check back to the village. Let me go and look at If you want the business to move, oh, it is customer service. You have to satisfy customer. Customer service, you. Oh, you must service your customer. Oh no, this is not happening. to the city to look for my sister. When I go to her place, they say she traveled. I know her lines has been switched off. I'm sorry, please. Why did you come back? I came back because my conscience was poking me. See, let me tell I, I, I don't used to steal before. I've never stolen in my life. So, so I, it, it's the devil. And, and I don't have transport fare. That was why I stole the money. How, how much do you need for, for your transport fare? 3,000 naira. 3,000 naira will take me to my village safe and sound. What's your name? Oma. You baited me last night. Uh, yes. You you stained all your clothes with vomit. So I had to bait you. I'm sorry about that. I I'm passing through family problems and um, heartbreak. I'm, I'm sorry about it. But whatever it is, alcohol should not be your only alternative. Let me drop you off. No, no, don't bother yourself. I know my way. I can go. Thank you very much.
am I even doing? Eh? I think I like him. Maybe I should have just allowed him to take me to the village. Yes. You don't, have, you don't let me go hungry all because I'm trying to help you. It's not fair. I need to be taken care of. Maybe can you just calm down? Okay? See, I'll get the money soon, okay? That's all you keep saying. How soon am I getting the money? Don't worry. You get the money in the next five days. Five days? Five days of looking pale and unkept. All because my so-called boyfriend cannot afford to buy me cream. You know what? This so-called relationship is over. Please stop. Babe! Wait! My mother is dying. She has a severe liver infection. And the doctor says she might die if I don't raise 200,000 Naira within a week. 200,000 Naira? Yeah, what do I do now? Hey! 200,000 Naira? Yeah. Hey, what about your uncle? Have you talked to him about it? Maybe he, he will be of help. I talked to me. He said he does not have any money right now. And um, please, can you just help me find a place where I can borrow this money? Eh? And I will pay back within a month. Please. I don't have... I don't have... I don't... I, I don't... Okay. Anything for you, yeah? Oh. Yeah, your mother will not die. Oh, oh, thank you. Your mother will not die. I will, I will try. I'm, I'm going to do everything possible to get the money. Thank you very much. Okay, just go to the hospital and stay with her. Yeah? Oh, Let me just you. hurry. Oh, okay, thank you. Thank, thank you. thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Customer service you. You must service your customer. If you want to meet your It is important in banking. Oh. You are in business to make customer happy. Mm. So that they will come again. If you have to kiss them, kiss them. If they want to love them, love them. Money for hand, they back for ground. Oh. That is the game. In business, you need customer service. Breast is for interest. Nyash is for deposit. Body for withdrawal. Oh. Customer service. What am I going to do now? Hmm? I really need to help him save his mother. I really need to help him save his mother. I don't, I don't want his mother to die. Okay? Oh, my thing. Okay? What am I going to do? Eh? Yes! Mama is the way out. I know Mama will not want to use ear to hear that Mama is with the Mama is the way out now. Let me go and tell my mother. Please now wait. Babe. Please now calm down and listen to me. Are you stupid? Did you just slap me? And I will slap you if you keep following me. Baby. Hmm. What did you say you want to use such amount of money to do? Do you want to start a new business? No, Mama. I want to use it to complete the money for my traveling. Travel? What travel? You did not tell me that you want to travel to anywhere. Hey, Mama, it's true. I did not tell you. I'm sorry, Bo. I want to travel to Scotland. Mama, see, I, I want to go and complete my master's. Yes, when I get to Scotland, I'm going to look for a job so I work side by side doing my master's and working. When I'm working, I will save enough money and return the money back for you. Seriously? Eh? Eh, no. Hmm. 
It is a nice idea. Yes, it's a nice idea. Okay. It's a nice idea. I will raise the money. In two days, you will come back and take it. Hey, Mama. <laughs> Chai. Mama, that's why I know that I will always count on you. Mama, thank I you. Will. Yeah. I will. And there's no need for me to start going and coming back two days' time. Let me wait. I will sit down and wait so that I will use the money and go. Uh -huh. hey, you say in two days' time. Uh, right? Yes. Uh -huh. I will wait for myself. I will use the money to <laughs> return. Okay. So I will not waste any time at all, at all. If you say so, if I may ask, why don't you tell your sister? Hey, Mama, I, I don't want to tell her. You know Sister Perry has a lot on her head. Eh? I don't want to tell her. See, I want us to plan it. Once everything is ready, I will not tell her to give me the money for my visa and other things I will be buying there before I'm stabilized. <sighs> Are you sure? Mama, have I ever lied to you? Now? Mama, you know. Are you sure? Mama, I'm sure now. You said two days, Abby. Okay. Oh. Mama, you said two days. Mm, I said two days. Okay. Mm. If you say. Mama, thank it's you. It's a nice idea. Thank you. I okay. don't know what I would have done without you. Oh. Nemo! You have to be careful. I'm always careful. You have mama. to be careful. You have I'm to be careful. careful. I'm careful, Mama. Please, now. Please, baby, please. Please. You have to save her. I don't want my mother to die, please. Oh. I have told you that I am currently working on something now. Your mother will not die. Your mother will not die. Your mother will not die. Your mother will not die, baby. Stop crying. Your mother will not die. Please, I don't know what to do right now. Yeah, don't cry again now. Why are you still crying now? You want me to join you to cry? Your mother will not die. Your Whose mother, mother is not dying? Die. Don't worry, I'll call you back later. Yeah, I'll call you back. Bye. Okay, baby. Okay, okay. Oh, thank you. Please hurry up. Whose mother is dying or see eh? Uh, is, uh, is that my... Talk! That, the person that is um, signing my documents, he said his mother is sick and is about to die. Hey, oh, chill. Hey! Hey, God forbid. His mother will not die in Jesus' name. Amen. She will not die in Jesus' name. Amen. Hey! Amen. <sighs> Good morning. Yes. Mama! Hi. My daughter, I want to get this money from our monthly dues contribution chairman. Hi. Yes. Hi. Hi, Mama. This one. Thank you. Oh, my dear. Thank you so much, oh. Mama. Hi. I will do everything for you, people. Mama, God will bless you. I know I can always count on you. Hi, <laughs> Mama. Is it's God that will bless you for me, my mother. God will bless you, Mama. Mama, you know what? Let me just quickly go and get my things. I want to start going. Huh? You are going back today. Hey, Mama, I was about to leave, you know. There's a document I need to sign urgently. That was part of what you was telling me before you came in. Let me quickly bring my bag. Hey, hey Mama, I'm coming. Oh, yeah, hurry up. It's all right. Hey, she will not die in Jesus' name. She will not die. My daughter. She's well with you. I am with my own. Hello, baby. Where are you? Don't panic. Calm down. I have a solution. Uh, where are you? Where are you? I'm coming to see you right away. Yes, everything is fine. I'm coming to see you. If you have to kiss them, kiss them. If they want to love them, love them. Money for hand, they back for ground. That is the game. In business, you need customer service. Breast is for interest, nyash is for deposit, body for withdrawal or customer service. Auntie is a banker, working in the bank. Breast is for interest, nyash is for deposit. Okay. How are you? Eh? How are you? You can see I'm not fine. If anything happened to my mother, I'm dead. Nothing is going to happen to your mother. Baby, see, listen, nothing is going to happen to your mother. I, I, 
I brought the money. Yes, yeah. sir. Eh, it took me time, but I brought it. You brought the money? Yes, yeah, something will happen to your mother. <sighs> See it. The complete money? Yes, yeah, complete. Wow. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. Thank you so much. See, see, I'll rush to the hospital now and go and see a doctor, okay? Okay, let me go with you. No, 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 you don't have to do that. I will call you immediately I come back, okay? All right? Don't worry, I'll call you, yeah? Thank you so much. Wow. Greet mama for me, oh. Okay. Yeah, that I'm praying for her. Nothing is going to happen to her. Even my mother is praying for her. She's covered with the blood of Jesus. Do you have the money or not? I don't want to hear stories. Calm down, eh? Look, I have the money, okay? Let me show you some money. It's right for me. Hi. Come on, get out some hug. If huh? you want. Come on. <laughs> oh, say. I love you so much. Zed, who is she? Later, Zed. Also later. Where is she? Can you just stop shouting at me? Zed. Me. I am shouting at you. Of course. Hey! Zed Remo! Hi! Zed! Give me my money! Give me my mother's money! Give it to me! What money are you talking about? The money I collected from my mother! Come on, leave me alone! Yes. Yes. so much about Perry. Here I go again thinking about her. Don't think about her. themselves physical injury. Stop it. I'm, I'm trying so hard to forget about her. I just want to forget about her. I forgot to ask. What is your name? Jim. This shouldn't have happened. I, I messed up big time. I just acted foolish. I, I shouldn't have done this. I... Can you stop? We're not kids. It just happened and... We don't have to kill ourselves. This did not happen. I don't know you, you don't know me. Let me go! Can, can you stop? What did I do to you? Can you stop acting childish? I want to go. Let me go. Okay, fine. Fine. You can go.
Um, well, um, I'm surprised you don't know me. My name is Sonia. I am Perry's friend. Oh, okay. Um, I heard your son is getting married to her. Mm -hmm. Well, um, I I'm telling you because I admire you a lot. Why would you allow a girl who has a son for your husband get married to your son? What? What are you talking about? Oh, you are not aware also? But it's French if Odo is aware of it. Okay, ma'am. I have to go. Like I said, I did what I did because I admire and respect you a lot. So, it's the decision is yours. Thank you. Um, well, um, I'm surprised you don't know me. My name is Sonia. I am Perry's friend. Oh, okay. Um, I heard your son is getting married to her. Mm -hmm. Well, um, I I'm telling you because I admire you a lot. Why would you allow a girl who has a son for your husband get married to your son? What? What are you talking about? Oh, you are not aware also? But it's French if Odo is aware of it. Okay, ma'am. I have to go. Like I said, I did what I did because I admire and respect you a lot. So, it's the decision is yours. Thank you. I gone wrong. I've been a good wife. I've been faithful. What did I ever do wrong to warrant this? Wait a minute. 
all these adjectives on me. I mean, what is going on? What have I done wrong? So the reason you asked her not to marry our son because she had a child for you. Where is this coming from? Like I said earlier, you are heartless. You are mean. You are an ungrateful man. I am leaving you and your house for God. Bring her in so that you both can enjoy your lives well. Calm down now. Calm down. I'm confused. Please calm down. Don't, don't, don't touch me. What is it? How can you lay that your filthy hands on me? In fact, they are dirty. These hands are useless because I have used it to touch another woman. Don't you dare touch me with them again. Calm down now. What are you talking about? as a child with another woman. Williams has a child with another woman and no one knows about it. A friend of the girl told me. How is that possible? In this town? Who would have heard about it? Gina, Williams had it planned out. Jim, my son, was supposed to get married to the said girl. But on the day he was supposed to propose to her, William swore never to allow it to happen, claiming the girl was her aunt's girl. This is unbelievable. Tell me, where did I go wrong? Oh, tell me. Wasn't I, wasn't I a good wife or haven't I been a good wife to him? You have been a good wife. It's okay. Talk to my wife. She's not here. Virginia, is that not her car? She wouldn't want to see you. But why? What, what, what did she say I did to her? Chief, are you here to pretend or to ask for her forgiveness? Forgiveness for what? I've already told her that I will look for Jim. So it's, what is all this all about? It's not even about Jim. It's not about Jim. So it's about what? What is it? Huh? I told you I would look for Jim. And I've started doing that. So why this? But he had a child for you. And you think you can hide it forever? No. Nothing is hidden under the surface of this earth. Perry, child, who is telling
telling you this despicable lie. Williams, don't lie. Don't keep lying because if it was not the truth, you wouldn't have stopped her from marrying our son. Look, let me tell you. Huh? Yes, I had something with Perry in the past. But she never had a child for me. That is the truth. Don't lie. Why do you keep lying? At your age, you're lying like us. Please, accept it so that we can make progress. Anyway, if you must know, Sonia told me everything. Sonia! Very, very unfair. did I tell? You're asking me? Huh? Of course. Why did you tell my wife that I have a child with Perry? Why? Me? I never told her anything of such. I only told her that Perry had a child with Chief Benjamin. I never mentioned your name, Chief. What is going on? I can't say. Now she's for deposit, body for with the wrong one. Customer service. Customer service, yo. You must service your customer. If you want the business to move, oh, it is customer service. You have to satisfy customer. Customer service, yo. You must service your customer. It is important in banking, you know. You are in business to make customers happy. So that they will come again. Gina, please. Help me talk to your friend. I can swear with my life that Perry had no child for me. I, I cannot hide such a high profile secret from my wife. It's not possible. My good friend is so shattered right now. I've never seen her in this kind of mood. God, this is the most trying time of my life. Please, help me talk to her. Chief, you know what? I think you should just go home and rest. Hmm? I'll try my best and talk to her. Please do. Thank you so very much. Thank you. Want the big deposit? Deposit. You have to bring a sweet benefit. Sweet benefit in business. You need customer service. Breast is for interest. Nash is for deposit. Body for withdrawal. No customer service. Auntie is a banker. Walking in the bank. Rest is for interest, now she's for deposit, body for with the wrong one, oh, customer service, customer service, yo. you must service your customer, if you want the business to move, oh, it is customer service, you have to satisfy customer, customer service, yo. you must service your I want
want to talk to you as a friend and a sister. If you give the devil space, he will break your home. Jenna, the home is broken already. There is no marriage. There is nothing to hold on to anymore. Well, you can still fix it. You have to take the bull by the horns. You have to work hard to make your home better. Whether he's married, has a child with another woman, doesn't really have any effect on you. You're legally married to him. You need to fix it now before things go beyond repair. So how do I find my son? Where do I go from here? If you make peace with the dad, definitely he'll come back home. I want to be more beautiful too. That's exactly how you are looking right now. Are you still on this? So that they will soon come. No, so no, no. Mm -hmm. Mama, we are almost done, eh? Today is my day. Yeah. And give my children, my wife, washing plates and assas. Eh, Mama, you could hear about that program. Mama, I, I don't want this, honestly. I room now, somebody. You know I'm not supposed to do this thing. I'm only doing it because of my illness. You go go zina yaws or biko. I hear you. Na boy ankesi. Oh. Boy ankesi ato pona le. Thank you. You know go. No, no. I've been struggling since to, to wash all these things. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, you don't know why you're going to go. I'm doing something. Hey! I don't want to go all these things. You'll be fast, I beg. Why are you talking to Chima? Yeah, so you have to be fast. Respect yourself. I'm now a Mrs. to be. You see? Yeah. <laughs> I can't say that again. <laughs> No, Go and uh, call her daughter eh, so that she can come and greet her husband and uh, his uncle. <laughs> Uh, and don't forget to tell him to run immediately and call a Foka. Eh? That he will be here. I want him to be here immediately. Eh? Please hurry up. Eh? Please. No, no, no. Hello. 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 Calm down now, eh? I want to look very beautiful. Today is my day. You know, Amaka. Uh -huh, now. Today is your day. Mama does not it's understand. It's once in a while. Uh-huh. Okay. Uh, no, no. Adamo. 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 Oh, 
Hey, so how was the journey? I hope it was smooth. Our journey has to be smooth, for we come for something very good. Beautiful. So we expect no impediments whatsoever. Aha. Hey, that is very good. Uh, where are these people? Let them hold you up. Eh? Norma. Sonia! You, Sonia! As I was saying, Chief, yes. I will always be there for you. Really? Yes, Chief. I mean, if you help me to get my target, trust me, I will always be there. Just call on me and boom, Sonia is there for you. Really? To rob you and make you happy. Good, you know what I can do. Chief. It's no problem. Agreement, we've agreed. It's a promise. It's a deal. Okay. Yes. Even if I get married tomorrow, that phone will not stop. All I want you to do is to help me. Help me to achieve this. I don't want to lose my job, please. You, Sonia. Is she the woman you want to marry? Yes, Uncle, she's the one. No, it can't be, it can't be. God have just saved you from Potiphar's wife. Uh, Uncle Potiphar's wife? I don't understand. What do you, you mean? You won't understand and I cannot explain to you here. We have to go, please. Let us go. I don't understand. Go away. We came here for something. You're telling you called Sonia, Sonia, you've not said anything. And you say, let's go. I don't understand. It's better you get married to a dog than to get married to this lady. Let's go. You won't yeah. understand. So okay. Let's go. What, what, is, what, what is the problem? We cannot marry a daughter. Oh, Why? Period. Let's go. Oh, Let's go. Calm down. Oh, how can you talk? You should even say anything. 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 I don't know. What is it? What's going on? I don't, I don't, I don't understand. Let's go. When we get. Yeah. Oh, uh, uh, uh. Sonia. 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 Madam, should have asked question before going to this girl. But uncle, you have not said anything that she did. <sighs> if I allow you to get married to this girl, your father will be very angry with me in his grief. It's Jacobwem. Uncle. Yes. Did you have anything to do with this girl? Mm-mm. But all I know, she sleeps with everybody in her club just to get promoted in where she's working. 
That's number one reason. Secondly, she had a child from my good friend, Chief Benjamin. Oh, no. Oh, no. 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 You said no? Oh, no. Oh, God. Well, I say yes. Take me back there. Let's go. You can't do what there. To verify. Because you must service the customer. If you want the big deposit, deposit, you have to bring a sweet benefit. Sweet benefit in business. You need customer service. Breast is for interest. Nyash is for deposit. Body for me the wrong one. Customer service. And can you just stop crying? Please. Cry will not solve anything. It won't. Sonia. Sonia. What is that man talking about? I might just want to die. I'm tired of living. I just want to die. You will not die. Hey, Foggy, you will not die, yo. Until you tell me what that man was talking about. Hey, man. Oh, no, that one. Why, best? Start talking. Why, oh, now? Sorry. Hey! Disgrace. If you want a big deposit, deposit, yeah. you have to bring a sweet benefit. Sweet benefit in business. You need customer service. Breast is for interest. Nash is for deposit. Body for withdrawal. No customer service. Auntie is a banker, working in the bank. Breast is for interest, nyash is for deposit. Body for with the wrong while no customer service. Customer service, you oh my God. You must service you your customer. Hey. If you want the business to move, on, yeah. it is yeah. customer service. You have to satisfy customer. Customer service, you. Service your customer. If you want to meet in your target, it is customer service. It is important in banking. You are in business to make customer happy. So that they will come again. If you have to kiss them, kiss them. If they want to love them, love them. money for hand, they back for ground. That is the game. In business, you need customer service. Rest is for interest, nash is for deposit, body for withdrawal, no customer service. Auntie is a banker, working in the bank. Rest is for interest, nash is for deposit, body for withdrawal, no customer service. Customer <laughs> service. Please. Please. I'm sorry. I am sorry, please. Chief, I am sorry. I am sorry, please. <laughs> Where is the child you had for Chief Benjamin? Child of what? In child? Yes, I'm only young one. Eh? Hey. You don't say. Sonia. Child. So you did not tell your people that you had a child for Chief Benjamin? I will come back very soon with you, Benjamin. Don't do anything stupid.
want us to kill you? <gasps> you! What are you doing in this village? You know her? Oh, she's my friend, I know her. She's my friend. Let's take her to the hospital. Okay, okay, okay. okay. Sorry, sorry, please, sorry. Please. Okay, easy, 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 easy. Easy, 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 easy. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Easy, easy, sorry, sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Easy. Sorry, eh? Where is your sister? Where is she? Mama, ever since I returned, though, she has not said a word to me. Hi. Hey. Mama. Huh? What is Perry doing in the village? <sighs> My daughter, it is a long story. A long story. Yes. Your sister has been behaving strange since she came back. This is not funny. Hey. But uh, where did she tell you that she's going to? Mama, I just told you that ever since I returned, she has not said a word to me. This is not funny. Ha. Excuse me, I'm coming. Where are you going to? Eh? Ipu Hey! My daughter has lost it all. What am I going to do? What kind of problem is this? Where will I start? What will I do? Hey! God, it's only you that will help me in this situation. Oh, I don't know what to do. Sonia, tell me where you kept that child. Go and be the belong one. Else, this house will not contain both of us. Sonia! Mama, Mama calm down now. Calm down first. Just calm down. Calm down. Amaka, isim calm down. Ungwa. Nabun. Amaka, una? Go. Go to your mother's house. What's this, sir? Una? Una? Ungwa. Sonia! Sonia! Uh huh. Go and be the belong one. Where is that baby? Mama. Mama, please leave her. You are disturbing her. Just allow her to cry. Pick her up here, Kobe Aqua. Get the papa why you know? Eh? You forget all of your arrogance. So now where is that baby? Okay. This is bad All right. Don't want to tell me up here. You see this house. This house will be so hot for you to stay. You get me? This house very very unbearable for you to stay. Go for this house. Until you bring the baby back. Can I allow her to cry now? Nah? Mama, I'm, 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 I'm a man. You have to allow her to cry. You, you don't know. Dad, 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 it's okay. 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 Mom should have allowed you to. Know. Please cry small, auntie. Auntie is a banker, working in the bank. Breast is for interest, nash is for deposit. Body for withdrawal, oh, customer service. Customer service, yo. You must service your customer. If you want the business to move, oh, 
it is customer service. You have to satisfy customer. Customer service, you. You must service your customer. If you want to meet your target, you. It is customer. Oh, Perry. What happened to you? Good day, Mama. Uh, what happened to her? My daughter, what happened to you? I had a slight accident. Accident? They, they already took me to the hospital. Hey! Hey, Wu. How are you feeling now? Hey, thank you. Thank you, sir. Come. Thank you so yeah, much. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. We'll what be on our feeling? way. Take care of yourself, Sorry. Man. Let's go inside. All right. Thank we'll you. We'll be on our way, man. Okay. Take care of yourself, man. Thank you. Thank you. You have to satisfy customer. Customer service, you. You must service your customer. If you want to meet your target, you. it is customer service. It is important in banking. You, know. you are in business to make customer happy. Sister. Why would you reject yourself because of what someone feels about you? I mean, you are beautiful. You are smart. You have a good job going for you. You can get any man of your choice. You won't understand. You won't. I understand. Sister, you are not the only one who have a terrible past. We all do. Any man who is not ready to accept your past is not worthy to be in your life. Period. Well, how do you expect me? How do you expect me to forget about everything just like that? It's not that easy. Love yourself more. That is the only way out. <laughs> Thank you, my sister. Thank you. <laughs> Anything for you, sister. You are my only sister. I got your back, 100%. So, first thing tomorrow morning, you are going back to the city. You are going to start afresh like a new flower that's about to blossom. I'll try. Not, I will try. I will try, say it. I will try. I will. <laughs> it's okay. Hey. Chin. This is the first time the thought of someone is just crossing my mind. Like, I can't just forget you. Ah, this is the first time falling has made my heart leap. Chin. I don't know why I'm missing you. And why are you smiling to yourself? <laughs> that tells me something. <laughs> Should I guess? Guess. You are in love, aren't you? Yes! <laughs> I guessed right. <laughs> <laughs> and who is this lucky young man? Because this is the very first time you're talking about a man and being in love as well. Yes. Um, sister, I met him when I went to the city to look for you and I was told that you've passed from your house. Oh, oh. He was the one that helped me. He even gave me money to come back home. Wow. But sister, it's just that I feel there's something special about him. <laughs> oh, ma. Well, if you really like him that much, why don't you give him a call? Call him. Hey, that's true. I did not collect his number. Are you kidding me now? Mm, that's fine. But the truth is, if you're really meant for each other, your path will cross again. Trust me on that. Okay. Alright, who help me out with something? Ah, <laughs> uh, so sister, how is your leg? Mm, gradually stopping. Yeah. 
They don't call it customer service for nothing Because you must service the customer If you want a big deposit Deposit You have to bring a sweet benefit Sweet benefit In business You need customer service Breast is for interest Nyash is for deposit Body for withdrawal or Customer service Auntie is a banker Sorry. I love you so much. I am hardly sorry. Please forgive me. I'm begging you. Why did you tell me about this? Because I was scared. Because I was scared of what is happening now. Because I was scared you would leave me. Because I just did not want to lose you. <laughs> Sonia, you're a bad seed. Sonia, you're a bad seed. So you lied to Chief and his wife that Perry had a child. Eh? Yes. I did it out of anger. I did it because I felt betrayed. I did it because I allowed anger to take the better part of me after what she did to me in the past. Please, my love. I am begging you with everything you hold sacred. I did not do it intentionally. <laughs> I was angry, I was bitter. <laughs> Please forgive me. <laughs> I'm begging you. <laughs> Please forgive me. Please. Go and tell Chief and his wife that you lied. Go and look for Perry. Ask her to forgive you. I mean, beg for her forgiveness for everything you did to her, including tarnishing her image. I will. I will do anything. I will do anything, anything at all to earn your forgiveness, please. Please, I am not a bad person. I was only betrayed. And I could not let go. <laughs> Go and clear your head off cobwebs. Auntie is a banker, walking in the bank. Breast <laughs> is for interest, now she's for deposit. Body for with the wrong one, oh, customer service. Customer service, yo. You must service your customer. If you want the business to move, oh, it is customer service. You have to satisfy customer. Some way you carry face like, like say all your village people die finish. What do you have? It's my friend inside. Oh, you mean Auntie Banka? Yes. No, she knows that she don't pack her motor. Did she did she tell you where she packed to? No, she not tell me anything. Okay, um, but do you have an idea how I can just locate I know, her? I don't know anything. I don't know anything. And say, Abek, since, since she back come on for this compound, now so, so people begin the final, 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 like saying, now today, which she come on for this compound. The day where we, she, she go there for you, nobody go come here. And say, Abek, they go and they do something. But I just wanted to. I don't get any of her contacts. Just they go make her go do something inside. Are they busy now? Sonia, what are you doing here? I 
came to apologize to you for everything that I did to you. I am sorry. Honestly, I just cannot tell what came over me. Whatever came over you was worse than wickedness itself. How could you tell such a lie? Even when I confronted you, you still denied it. Why? I'm ashamed of myself. I can't even look you in the eyes to tell you how sorry I am. Please, Chief, find a place in your heart to forgive me. I will do anything. I will do anything at all just to make up for my mistakes. I am sorry. I am sorry, please. You don't know what came over you. Now, if you want me to forgive you, then you have to follow me to go and see my wife. Then you tell her the truth. Okay? Yes, Chief. Wait for me. Customer service you. You must service your customer. If you want the business to move up, it is customer service. Fine body, fine money. Customer service you. Let's go. You must service your customer. If you want to meet in your target, it is customer service. Wonderful personal service. Customer service. You, you must service your customer. If you want the business to move. Where is my wife? She's inside. Go call Let me her. Call. Forgive me. I never meant to break your home. And I lied against your husband. What? Yes. I did it to spite Perry. Please forgive me and beg you. Please have mercy. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. What did Perry ever do to you? Uh, 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 only please, please. At least now you know I wasn't lying to you. Go and take your things. Let us go home. Please. Young lady, what did Perry ever do to you for you to treat her in this manner? Tell me. It's okay. At least you know the truth now. Okay? Let us go home, please. Get up. God bless you. Chief, I'm sorry. Please. Customer service. If you want the business to move, it is customer service. 
I will come on weekend, oh? No, no, ma, don't stretch yourself. I will come and pick you myself, oh? Good day, ma. <laughs> You're welcome. Good day. Yeah, good afternoon. Perry, uh, how are you? I'm fine. And how's the leg? Um, it's, it's better now. The yeah. pain has stopped. Fine. Mm. <laughs> I'll beat you. And where are you both going with this luggage? We're going back to the city. Mm. I have to resume work on Monday. <sighs> Is it right? So, can I have the pleasure of dropping you both? Yes, I know. Oh, that's really very thoughtful mm. of you. Thank you so much. Thank, thank you. you. Thank, thank you, my son. <laughs> okay, Mama. Mm. Take good care of yourself. Mm. Okay. Make sure you eat and take your medication. Mm. Not even now. I will. Biko. I will. Makakoko. Mm. Oh, take wonder. care of yourself. Mm. My boy, oh my God, bye bye. Bye bye. Let me help you. Alright. Ma, please always do the needful. Oh, oh, okay. My son, I don't miss me too much. Okay. Don't miss me too much, Mama. Oh, I know you are missing me already. I should not come. Don't come. I will come. Alright, Mama. Oh, Take care. Bye. Bye, 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 Customer service for nothing because you must service the customer. If you want the big deposit, deposit you have to bring a sweet benefit. Thank you. Maybe I'll come some other time. That is if you invite me. <laughs> well, you can come anytime you want. At least you know where I stay now. Thank you. Take good care of your sister, okay? Mm -hmm. It's alright though. Alright then, take care. Okay, I'll be on my way. Okay. <laughs> I should take good care of you. So. I'll do it. <laughs> Let me start the assignment. <laughs> Seems like you like him, don't you? Hmm? I didn't hear what you said. Seems like you like him, don't you? <laughs> yeah, started. <laughs> what do you mean by that? <laughs> Sister, I don't know if I like him. I don't know. Hey, for now he's just a friend of mine. Hey, sister, wait. Let me tell you something. He's very cute and handsome. You know, <laughs> it would not be a bad idea if you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, but what? Madam, welcome. Uh, how are you? Madam, since you left, people were fishing for you like water. But when you do around, nobody will find you. No problem. You can go back to your duty post. And I need to come. I said go back to your dinner, you Chris. Know, what I'm saying is that the boy is very fast. How do we find my son? I want to see him. I want to make sure he's safe. Don't worry. He's safe. I have reported the matter to the police and I'm working with them. Um, you know his car has a tracker. So I have given the information of the tracker to them. They will soon track the car and will know where he is. What if he's not in this country? We can't track, track him to, do, to do where he is overseas or something. I know my son. He's not the type that will jet out of the country because of little things like this. Who will find him? He's not going anywhere. Okay? So just calm down. I just miss him. Constantly not seeing him around this house. Wrong door. 
don't know. Is she in the back of the studio? Will you shut up? I'm afraid go in there and take your crazy bag and get out of here. I was looking for someone to talk to. I just, I just needed someone to talk to, and I, I don't have your number. I would have called. You were nowhere to be found. I swear. Just that. You now do wrong, girls. I can see you are a ladies man. I have to leave here before I am counted as one of your bronze girls. You, you, don't, you don't have to leave. What, what are you doing to me? I was waiting for you to come and heal me. And here you are trying to walk out again. Can't you see I'm in love with you? Do you have a home? I don't want to go back to that house. For how long? For how long will you keep running away from your home like a prodigal son? I'm not a prodigal son. I told you what happened. Real men don't run away from their home because of heartbreak. Do you have a mother? Yes. So don't you think you're hurting her by running away from your home? Don't you? You have to leave here now. So you're going to go in there, pack your things, we are going to your house. Thank you, Father. 
Let me go to the kitchen uh, to attend to what I put on the fire. Uh, Ma, please, can I join you? Of course, you can. Thank you. Jim, this one is special. <laughs> Welcome home. Son, I can see that you've got yourself a decent girl. I mean, for sight. I could spell it. Come. You're welcome. Thank you, Father. Okay. There is something really special about this one. Yes, Dad. And I would like to apologize for, for being stubborn. Come on, son. There is no need for you to apologize. As a matter of fact, uh, I overreacted. Now tell me, do you love this one? I cannot explain what I feel for her. Maybe, maybe she's sent by God to settle the whole fracas. Well, in that case, um, you need to start making preparations for you to visit her people as soon as possible. You like her? Well, um... She has a free spirit. Yeah. I mean, you can tell easily. But let me ask you this. Do you still love Perry? No. I think I've changed my mind about her. I see. It's all right. You're not taking your drink. No father, I'm fine. You don't like it? Sam, food is ready. It's alright, I will do it to show you. something very terrible you know I don't want to do this for now you see Perry that is why I have come please allow me to mend your broken heart you see since the very first day I saw you at the bar I have always been thinking about you I had a terrible story, a very terrible one. What could be more terrible that love cannot conquer? Love itself hasn't been fair to me. Yeah, see, people love in different ways. Please, give me a chance 
to prove my love for you. I don't want to hurt you. I also do not want you to hurt me either. If you ask me to leave, I will leave. If you insist that you want to go down this way with me, then you have to listen to me talk. I have to tell you my story. And if it's fine by you, then we can go ahead. Our mind is made up. Your story cannot change it. However, I'm listening. His name is James. Our meeting was an accident. But he was so loving, caring, adoring. He was an amazing man. He loved me so much. And I loved him as well. But just about time we were about to seal our relationship. The past came knocking. Healthy. What am I going to say? It's a healthy thing yeah. together. Okay. Thank you. It's another life. Do you sure you don't want to go to the first? No, no, I'm good. Jim, where do you say you meant this girl? It's a long story, Mom. Don't worry, we'll talk about it later. No, we'll talk about it now. I like her and I want her to know. I just finished serving, sir. So, um, what's your discipline? Public administration, sir. Mm -hmm. I think I will employ her. No, 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 no. I will employ her in my company as my human resources manager. Hey, no. Just allow her to make her choice. She's here. Wouldn't you like to work for me? Ma, uh, ma. I'm short of words, so I don't know what to say. <laughs> mm -hmm. You resume on Monday. <laughs> Thank you, Ma. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Ma. Thank Just you, sit. Ma. Thank you. Call me Mommy, okay? <laughs> Thank you, Mommy. <laughs> Honey, yeah. This is not fair. What is not fair? You just oppressed me. <laughs> My love is not true. <laughs> Ladies first. about this new development. <laughs> and who says you're going back? Huh? Mm -hmm. I have to go to my house now, my sister's house. I, I did not bring any clothes. I we'll know. Go for shopping. Now that you've heard my whole story, do you still want to do this? The story cannot change my mind. Just give me a chance to love you and take you to America by next month. I will be traveling back. What do you do in America? I'm a certified pilot. A pilot? 
We'll give it a try. If you don't, take this for me. Love it. Thank you. It's beautiful. Thank you. You sit down. So what can I offer you? You've offered me the most, the most important thing, which is giving me your heart. But at least I need to give, even if it's water. How do I go about this now? Oh, should I tell my wife? No. no. That girl and my son are more important to me. Yes. I must find a way of getting over this issue. There must be a way out. Morning. We did not take your dinner. And since you came back, you've been sad. Is everything all right? How can everything be all right? When I have you as a wife. What have I done again? Eh? What has gone wrong? I am sad. As you can see, I'm old already. And I have no child of my own to show for it. There you go again. Eh? Must you say this all the time? Why not allow peace in this house so that the child could come? Are you stupid? You have the effrontery to open this your barren mouth to talk back at, at me. Is that what? Don't let me lose my temper on you. Has it gotten to that? Has it gotten to a point that you address me as a barren woman? But I'm sure of one thing. I didn't make myself a barren woman. For crying out loud. I didn't. You see yourself? Looking for ways to justify yourself. You didn't make yourself a barren woman. Now what? No problem. Good. First thing tomorrow morning, you are getting out of my house. Pack your things first thing tomorrow morning and leave my house. Is that clear? Do I make myself clear? No, honey, it has not got into this. Please. It has not got into that height. Please. I'm sorry. Eh? If, if, if I said anything that has made you angry, please, I'm so sorry. Eh? Forgive me. Don't touch me. Don't let me lose my temper on you. Don't. Please, I'm sorry. Please, forgive me. If I've said anything that makes you angry, please, I'm so sorry. Get your hands there now and leave this room. Honey, can you please stop this drama? What is it? You call this drama? If you don't leave this room this moment, I'll call my boys to come and handle you. What have I done to you? Why this sudden change, honey? Why? You refuse to give me a child. Oh. You don't want to leave? Stand up. Want to come and occupy space that my son and my wife will occupy. 
not in my house. Go and live your barren life there. Honey. Oh, you are still there. We go and don't throw me out like this. I said, will you go and live your life there? I cannot be staying with a man in the, in the house. Eh? I did not know that you are the bad that barren. Not sense. Please, give me some water. Children will come. Children will come. I can imagine. I'm getting old already. No child. Nothing to show for it. And I'm staying with one woman's school called herself my wife. Please, I have no place to go to. I've lived with you for 20 years. Where would I go to? If I come to meet you out there, you won't, you won't like what I will do to you. You better leave that place now. If I come out there, you won't believe your eyes open. But I think I have something done. Oh, Jesus. Don't throw me out of If you don't leave that place now, if I come out there, you won't, you won't like what I will do to you. Where will I go to? Oh! What are you still doing here? I said leave my house now. Enough. I cannot be staying with a man like myself in the same house. Huh? How many years now you said? 20 good years, no child. What am I staying with you for? I have tried to have you to this level. Now you are as fat as this. Let somebody else have it. No problem. Go and give it to another man. It might be better with him, you don't know. Huh? I said, leave my house. Oh, you want me to call my boys to come and throw you out, is it? Stand up, stand up, Alice. Carry, 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 and get out. Woman, man. When people are giving children to their husbands, you're going to say, I think my food. It didn't come very fast. Oh, you want me to call my boys to come and throw you out? Honey, I, I don't know why this sudden change. But remember, I loved you. I have loved you for 20 good years. Oh. Even the time you cheated on me. Nothing still changed my love for you. Even at hard times. Do it. Hey, love of the love. Don't just throw me out like this. I cannot change my mind. I have... Taking decision and that is final. If I go in there and come out and you're still here, you will not know what I'll do to you. Please. You better pack your things now before I call my boy. <laughs> come and throw me. <laughs> I've not been able to give him my child. Stop. Just stop crying and tell me how it happened. Okay? My heart is broken. I know. Just calm down. We never had any issue. I asked him why he didn't take his dinner. <laughs> he told me that he's angry with me. That I've not been able to give him a child. <laughs> Initially, I thought he was joking. Honestly, I thought he was joking. The next thing, this morning he pushed me out of the house. Never met you. Where do I start from? <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. No, but you know what? Men Who can I want to have The difference between a man and a woman is like from here to Jamaica. But I think there is something he's not telling you. Mm. Yes. That shouldn't be a problem. Don't worry about it. God will disappoint him. Alright? In fact, 
Let's go upstairs. There are places you will go. Don't cry. Wipe your tears. Yes, sir. Good. That your friend thinks that she can hide away from me forever. I will find her. And when I get her, I will punish her before taking away my son. Chief, thank God you're here. I've been looking for you everywhere. I've been, I've been, I've been looking for you. So, has she told you she has gotten my son? There is no son, Chief. I lied. You lied? Yes. She was never pregnant for you. I wanted her to feel the pain of what she did to me in the past. So I, I, I lied against her just to spite her. I'm sorry. You see yourself? You lied to me. Thunder will fire you, this girl. You made me to send my wife away. Hi. How do I get my wife back now? I will come back for you. And when I come back for you, you will die. Still. They don't call it customer service for nothing. Because you must service the customer. If you want a big deposit, deposit yeah. you have to bring a sweet benefit. Sweet benefit in business. You need customer service. Breast is for interest. Nash is for deposit. Body for withdrawal. No customer service. Auntie is a banker. Walking in the bank. Breast is for interest. Nash is for deposit. Body for withdrawal. No customer service. Customer service, you. you must service your customer. If you want the business to move, it is customer service. You have to satisfy customer. Customer service, you. How could I have been this stupid? How can that little girl use my head like a small boy? Oh, how do I get my wife back now? That girl must not go unpunished. I will so deal with her when she least expects. I'd like to see your sister tomorrow. <laughs> that would be nice. Why not invite her for lunch? Uh, I know my sister. She won't come. You know she has been avoiding me lately. Mm, give her a surprise of her life by inviting her first before I come. How about that? Yeah, that's nice. You have a point there. <laughs> I just want to meet her. I believe that will make you happy. Yes, it will. That would be nice. That's a nice idea. So? <laughs> I'm 
getting so used to you. Today and his mother offered me a job. She said I can start on Monday. Yeah. <laughs> You're kidding me. No, I'm serious. Oh, sis, congratulations. <laughs> Come here. Oh, congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, I did. Sis, he's inviting you over for lunch tomorrow. Why not, honey? Oh, come. <laughs> Thank you so much. I'm so excited. I'm happy too. Congratulations, <laughs> sis. Sis, I'll be Wow, it calls for celebration. Yes, it does. We're going for lunch, aren't we? Mm -hmm. Of course we will. <laughs> oh, I have come to apologize. Whatever embarrassment. For the embarrassment I caused to you and your family. Chief Odo, you don't need to apologize. It's all in the past. Okay? The onus is now on us to educate the young generation for them to help if they can without asking for pleasure in return. Because if they do, it will surely come back to haunt them. You are right. Thank you very much. Thank you. So, you were saying something about your wife. Oh, yes. I had a little issue with her, and I sent her away. Little did I know that Sonia lied. Chief Odo, you mean you sent your wife away because of what Sonia said? Huh. Yes. That girl is evil, and evil will befall her. In fact, I want my wife back. You want your wife back? Anyway, I will talk to my wife. Hmm? I will ask her to talk to your wife. All right? Thank you very much. You're welcome. So, what can I offer you? What drink would you like to take? Sorry, uh, in the mood I am now, uh, I don't think I can take anything. Come on. You can't come to my house and uh, refuse my drink. Hmm? Please talk to your wife. To talk to my wife. For she's no longer picking my calls. Well, like I told you, I will talk to my wife. I'm very sure that uh, your wife will listen to her, okay? It's okay. Oh, should I wait for your wife to come back? Uh, no, that's not necessary. Okay, I have told you I will talk to her. Don't worry, we'll sort it out, okay? I feel so ashamed of myself. For I suddenly become a drunk. So, would you want me to come home with you? To keep you company? If you do that, I'll be glad. That will save me a bottle of headache. Good. So let me pick up my car keys, okay? After this, I will avoid these young girls. They are evil. They, they, they wreck happiness. I will repent entirely for life. No more. Chief Odo! Ah. Please, I'm sorry. 
Forgive me. It will never happen again. But what came over you? What came over you? I was stupid. But I will never be stupid again. I have forgiven you. Ah. Thank you, man. Thank you very much. It's okay. Let me get my bag. Jim <laughs> Odo! My friend. Mr. William, you did it. You want to shake me? Please do. After you refused my drink. I accept it. <laughs> accept my apology. <laughs> Come here. <laughs> ah, now you're happy. Yes, very, very. Next time, be careful. It will never happen again. <laughs> You must service your customer If you want the business to move oh, It is customer service Fine body, fine money Customer service oh, You must service your oh, customer Go, go, go What? Go down What exactly have you come here to do? What are you doing in my house? What? The question What are you doing here? Mary, my friend. I am sorry. I am sorry for everything I did to you. Please find a place in your heart to forgive me. What? I never meant to do those things. I am sorry. But why, Sonia? Why? Why did you have to do all that to me? After everything we shared, why did you have to? Why? Because I was jealous of everything that you've achieved. I could not control my jealousy. You know what? I'm actually glad you did it. Because if not, I would have fallen prey to your wickedness, which would have led to my death. But thank goodness you actually did. Thank you, Sonia. Thank you. Honey. Babe? What's going on here? Tony! You know her? Let's go inside and leave this filthy thing here. Water! Hey, 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 do not, do not touch. Water! Ah, come here. I'm so look at sorry. this woman. Look at this woman very Take a very good look at her. Look at her. Listen, I want you to send her out of my compound and never let her in here again. Never. Only that one. Yes. Get this filter thing away from here. Only please let's go. Can she? <laughs> Man. How do they go now? Maybe we will not begin the fight now. Me and a gentleman, I hate fight. Move. Move If you know happen here, I'm say, Madam, say, make I push. I know one push. My fine girl, be I know one push. The good. Customer service, you. You must service your customer. If you want to meet the other get it is customer service. It is important. Customer happy, mm. so that they will come again. If you have to kiss them, kiss them. If they want to love them, love them. money for hand, they back for ground. Oh, that is the game. In business, you need customer service. Breast is for interest, nyash is for deposit, body for withdrawal. Oh, customer service. Auntie is a banker, walking in the bank. Breast is for interest. She's for the city, hey. but if for with the wrong one, we'll go. Customer service, customer service, you. you must service your customer. If you want the business to move, it is customer service. Biggie bum bum, biggie deposit, you. Customer service, you. you must service your customer. If you want to meet the other. Customer service. Account office service. 
Where is that boy? I'm begging you. I've been wandering in this city. Can I at least rest? Please, I don't mama. care. If I'm, I don't care if you like be a fugitive in the city. I told the main man. All I know is go and get with that boy. Else, you will not sleep in. In fact, you will not have rest. I need that boy now. Go and get with that boy. Okay, whoever. Go and get with that. Be careful. Mama, don't do this, yo. That's what I'm doing. Okay. Hey! Yeah. Hey! I think you say back, what? Hey. Mama, you go say. Mama, I think you say, get out of my house. Mama, please. 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 Mama, 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 Huh? I said you're going to get me that child. Oh, no, 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 no. Well, please, mm. where is that boy? Oh, Do I tell my mother that I sold a child? What am I even going to say to her? <laughs> For child trafficking. Can I at least talk to my mother? Move on. Move, move. I told you about. You? So you were the one that made my sister go through hell? Don't worry yourself, Mama. God has fixed everything. Tony has done the right thing. We have been waiting for you. Perry. Will you marry me? Tony. Will you be the mother of my unborn children? Marry me. Yes, I will. Yes! <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. I appreciate this. Oh, you've made my day. But the good news is that I am extremely happy where I am right now. Of course I am. I'm sorry for everything. No, 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 you don't need to be sorry about anything. You don't need to be. If you hadn't left, Tony here wouldn't have come into my life to spice it up like this. He really hurt me, but it's fine. That's in the past. But I am so fine right now. My sister told me everything. How you've been showing her so much love. How your parents embraced her and accepted her well, even with a job offer. Thank you so much for that. I am sorry to disappoint you, Mr. Jean. I am taking my sister to America for her masters. Honey, let's get out of here. Hey, 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 come on, hey, hey. hey. 
funny. Please, like you said, I came in and I spiced up your life. Let's allow them spice up their own life. Oh no! He needs to feel the pain I felt. The pain of rejection that I felt in the past. He needs to feel it. Honey, honey, calm down, okay? Calm down. If truly what you said I came to spice up your life, then you should be okay, eh? Please. to lose Omar. How? Did you have any problems with her? She's Perry's younger sister. What? How? How did that happen? We went for a long journey. I met Perry. I don't even know what to do now. And what is this melancholic looks on your faces? Oma is Perry's sister. Who told you that? Ginger said it. We went for a lunch date and lo and behold, I I met Perry. I couldn't believe it. It's not a good one at all. Uh, well, I I don't care if Uma is Perry's sister. I will not stop you from marrying her. Dad, you don't understand. She says she's taking her to US for her masters. And that means I'm not going to see her again. Numbers were switched off, and you caught me as if I, as if I did um, something wrong. Come on, I'm talking to you. It's a very small place. In fact, this world is smaller than a small place. I don't understand. Um, okay, what's the story this time around? I don't even know how to start. So tell me, has your father finally accepted Perry? I fell in love with another girl, Dan. 
Guess who she is? Who? Perry's younger sister. Ooh, what are you saying? You fell in love with Perry's younger sister? How? Where? When? The story is long, my brother. But the upshot is that Perry has sworn never to let me have anything to do with the sister. No! So, okay, okay, wait. So you're being rejected? Wow. I'm on this word now. A very funny word, though. Very funny indeed. I love Oma. I love her so much. So, how did you do it? How did you maneuver Perry's love? to loving her sister because it seems strange to me. God brought her to me to soothe what happened between Perry and I. Ah. Well, I'm not seeing the possibility of Perry allowing you to marry her sister. Then I would just have to run away with her. Your father and I have agreed to go see Perry tomorrow. As to ask for her forgiveness. Sometimes a family goes through hurdles. In order to make them stronger and more united. What has happened so far? is a sign that we're more united now and stronger and better people. We don't need to keep beating ourselves because we have learned that lesson of life. That united we stand and divided we fall. Everything is fine now. Let me go prepare and go to bed.
We are not coming to your place to see your sister. Before signing this she will not pass from the church. Oh my God. Uh, we owe your sister another. No, I do not need any of your apologies. Not at all. Can you allow your sister to follow her heart? I'm not stopping her. She's free. As a matter of fact, I am here because my wedding will be happening soon. So my husband and I decided to come invite you guys. This is the card, please. I. Um, cordially inviting all of you. And to you, Jim, if you invite us, you would come for yours. Thank you so much, sis. I love you. I love you too. You don't have a problem. I just want you to be happy. <laughs> yeah. Right. Perry. I'm deeply sorry for everything. I also want you to know that I... I wish you the best. Same here. I wish you the best as well. And please, do know that she is the only one I've got. You have to take good care of her. All right. We'll be on our way. Can I get enough of you, Of course, ma'am. Of course. Very good. Thank you. Breast is for interest, nyash is for 